We have a Delincia in the background here who has had, she's had like a little bit of a makeover. She looks like slightly different than usual. I did improve quality of life for a little bit. I was trying to like, I was just trying to like, I wanted to still look like Delincia, which I think she does. Thank you very much. I think she does, but she just looks like a slightly enhanced version of herself. Do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> just slightly enhanced, but in a, in a kind of a tasteful way. Because Delincia is like a god, isn't she? Do you know what I mean? To many of us. Um, yes. So, like, her hair is a slightly different colour. She's I, like, tweaked the eyes a little bit. Sorry, Delincia. Her eyebrows are slightly different. She's wearing lipstick. Um, and I use Fashionist to hide her helmet. She is wearing basically what our... Oh, gosh. Bearer was wearing yesterday. So she's in, like, super buffed armour. Every single piece gives her loads of strength weapon damage. She's already a hard hitter, though. Um, and we, she's got bolt plating on each piece as well. So I thought today, because um, we did all the dungeons, we've finished the dungeons now. We will redo dungeons. We need to, like, farm them and stuff. But today I thought we would take her out and level her up because she's, no, she's level zero at the moment. Why is that zero lower than the word level? squirrel okay <laughs> that was such a squirrel moment uh so yeah let's level her up i want to start at the unnamed city you just do like a round or two at the unnamed city um and then i want to look for some good crafting thralls today because we are missing a shield right um we have a scout right which is the person who reduces the armor weight uh of your armor the weight of your armor i use the word armor too many times there um so yeah i'd like to her to have even more kind of armor value um same for us really i want to kind of craft my armor with shield right and then put armor reduction kits on and maybe we'll like compare the stats once we've done that um yes what else do i want to do so there is an xp event currently on starting today and running until the 14th of december um which will allow us to hopefully level our battle pass a bit quicker um, currently I am up to, oh god, 23, level 23. We've got to get all the way up to 60. Um, and I particularly want to do that because I built this freaking pyramid and it ain't got no decorations, people. <laughs> My mum would be like, that is not a sentence, Anna. Um, yes. Um, so I would like to get all the bits and bobs in the battle pass before we run out of time. Um, we have a bit of time left because, uh, it's the 14th of December that's... Oh, God. Yes, that chapter three releases. Okay. Are you not a... Are you not a detained? Are you not a detained? I love that. I might have to use that. Um, so, yeah. So, maybe we'll do a bit of admin um, battle pass farming first. See how far we can get with that. Then we'll take Delincia and um, we'll do the Unnamed City and we'll go out and we'll see if we can find ourselves a shield, right? So, I'm going to place her here for now. I don't want to level her doing like the admin stuff because i enjoy leveling them right um yes i have did i place a couple of boxes so we're going to put our stuff in a box and i'm going to show you what i would do to level the bar pass as quickly as possible uh, this place is too big chat our house is too big okay did i not where are my boxes did i was i standing right next to them hello hello what did i oh they're over there okay I placed a couple of boxes and I completely forgot. All right, so I'm. it doesn't matter because we're going to do admin stuff. I am in admin mode at the moment. I'm in, like, creative mode. Let's give all our stuff. Um, these two. I don't want to use any of my normal things. I don't want to lose durability. There we go. We can fit everything in one box. Um, we're going to keep with the same armor because that's fine. Squirrel! Yes, indeedy. Um, let me get rid of this, like, journey thing from my screen show journey steps because i don't like a bit too much clutter um and then we're going to work through the challenges so i'm going to give myself a good weapon i'm going to give myself my usual back to corbin um, but i'm going to give myself one that hasn't i don't want to worry about the durability while i'm like adminning stuff i could do all sorts of things i could increase the value of my strength and things like that um i could change the amount of damage i do to enemies the amount of resistance they have i'm not going to faff around with that too much i want to be able to do it on like a regular playthrough like this um yes so you can go to single play you can fuss about with your uh strength and things like that and ch add, add more attribute points and all that stuff if you want to i'm not going to do it i'm just going to do it kind of quickly is the plan we do have a couple of people outside from last time we did this a couple of friendos 
Sumerian berserk two berserkers. They will help us. They will be fine. They've both got this one's got Arjar's Bane. Um this one has got the Watchblade, which is a now glowing strength based thingy. Let me give them some something to heal with. Exotic feast for the purposes of this exercise. We'll give them some pork to buff their strength. And we will give them some black lotus potion. So that they do more damage. There we go. So you can have one of those. You can have one of those. You can have a little drinkaroo because you enjoy a drink. She's like, I beg your pardon, what are you implying? There you go. You can have... Why do you have dragon horns? Hello? Okay. Um, You can have a snacky. And you can have one of those. Get drunk, lady. And there's your healing foods. All right. So they will help us with our bits and bobs. Um, so let's see what we have to do first, shall we? Um, we're going to work on, on these things on the right-hand side. Right, so we have 15 re-rolls. Let me see what it says on the tweet from Funcom. Let's have a look. Dum, dum, dum. Okay. So, um, prepare for the release of Age of War Chapter 3 with the upcoming Battle Pass boost. From the 1st of December to the 14th, slay through your remaining levels with increased daily boosters. Okay. Uh, so I guess these big boosters over here. Booster value increase. And then extra daily rerolls. So normally we have like three rerolls a day, don't we? So we'll give it a go. We'll see how much we can do today. Um, maybe we'll have to do it like a couple of times. I just hiccuped. Um, yes, but we'll we'll kind of power through that. We'll do that first, get it out of the way with, and then we'll get on with our lives, shall we? Uh, right, what are we going to do first? So we're generally I want to do this. Completely sunder an elephant. Ugh. Okay, so fortunately I have my hammer here. Um, let me... For this, I'm going to fight oh, just away from them. Completely send an elephant. So I'm going to probably spawn in um, the boss elephant. I'm not going to spawn him as like a friendo. So I'm going to do ele okay. elephant. Elephant boss. Bu -bu -bu. Elephant alpha. Uh, hold on a minute. One. Nope. So not an elephant alpha. I don't even know if I've seen the alphas for those. Where's the boss? Wild elephant. Oh, that was a pet. Okay, Thunderfoot. Sir, could you get out the ground? One. Oh my god. Could you... Hold on a second. Let's try that again, but like spawn him above ground. <laughs> Uh, how is everybody doing? How's your Friday? What are you up to? Have you finished your battle passes? Um, Wild Elephant Alpha. There we go. So, one, two, three, four, five. Okay. We'll just get rid of you, crazy person. There we go. Completely sunder an elephant. Claim reward. Okay. Completely sunder a rhino. Let's do the same thing. Rhino. Rhino, rhino, rhino. Wild rhino. Uh, wildlife rhino king. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. There we go. Let's get rid of him so he doesn't cause any havoc. Okay. I'm not harvesting them. I'm not trying to, like, gain anything except finish my battle pass. Okay. Claim reward. Uh, Exhausted just got home from work. Well, well done for getting through the week. Need to base build and thrall hunt. Send it and just use a stone weapon for less damage. Uh, I've done this before. I, this is how we do it. He's hiding, hoping hoping you'll leave. Oh my god. Sand swimming, yes. He's hiding, yes. Um, yeah, I mean, I could, I could spawn in a smaller one and use a low-level weapon, but there's no need to. Hello, Bidu. Hello, hello. 14th of December is my birthday is it ah oh, you got anything nice planned um okay eat something spicy no problem spicy spiced bum bum spiced haunch let's come out of creative mode for that for a second there we go all right i'm gonna see how quickly i can do this visit the forgotten city of zelhar let me make it daytime 
because it's easier. And then freeze time. There we go. Uh, Zelha, 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 Zelha is like over here. Uh, if anyone thinks this is cheating, it's not. If, if, if it was, I mean, it is cheating, but it's it's perfectly fine. I mean, you you can either do this or you can pay for level unlocks. <laughs> You know, and they're they're fine with it. It's not like against the rules or anything. Defeat an imp king. Okay, I could spawn him in, but it's just as easy to just teleport to the eastern barracks over here. There we go. This is an imp king. There we go. This is where we are because I did that quite quickly. There we go. It's yeah, it's easy, quicker than spawning, right? Uh, claim reward. Defeat tigers. I only need to defeat two tigers. Ba -ba -bum. I'm just going to spawn in two tigers. Wildlife tiger. There we go. Claim reward. Because I'd already killed a couple. Dance the Pagoda of Boundless Lusts. This is a big XP boost. 150. Pag Pagoda of Boundless Lusts is here. Let's teleport over it in the jungle. Okay, we'll run over and we'll dance over here. Da -da -dum, da -da -dum. So, dance emote. There we go. Achieved. Claim reward. Loads of XP. Uh, gather Crimson Lotus. Okay, there's Crimson Lotus at Mounds of the Dead in the center over here. Da -da -da -da, which is a tough northern NPC camp. Um, it doesn't matter if we use a sickle or anything. I'll tell you what, yes, we'll just gather it. It's fine. There we go. We only need to loot two. Claim reward. Forget, <laughs> visit the Forgotten City of Zelhar again. Okay. These things pop up again and again. Okay, done. Claim. Contribute to a coffer value valued over 5,000. Okay, we can do that. We've already done it before at our own coffer. Just to encourage you to use the treasure system. So we'll go home. Bum, 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 bum. Do, do, do. Thank you, phone, for being noisy. Da, 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 da. Contribute to a coffer valued over 5,000. So I guess I could just put a gold coin in. I bet I could take out a gold coin. And then put it in there. No? Does it have to be an individual item? Um, I do have this treasure here. Pick it up. So heroic treasure is worth 5,000. There we go. Okay, so you have to contribute an item um, over 5,000. So the coffer itself doesn't have to be 5,000. The individual item you contribute. These bits of treasure, you can watch my uh, Purge 101 video. I show you a bunch of different places uh, where you can get heroic treasure on my YouTube channel. Okay. Claim that reward. Skin of Sabretooth. Okay. Okay. We'll spawn in a saber tooth. We'll do it outside, shall we? Let me get a skinning knife. Bum 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 bum. Saber saber saber. Wildlife saber. We could kill a, a baby saber. It'd be quicker if you wanted to. I'm not in creative mode anymore. Doesn't matter too much. There we go. Skin a saber. There we go. Uh, next thing. Claim reward. Apply Sender Cripple and Bleed to a single creature. This is a big one. Um, I'm going to do it... I'm just going to go to... Azagoth. And just use a Mammoth because I felt like it. I don't know why. Um... Let me just go into thingy mode. Sunder Cripple Bleed. Okay, let's use a bad 
Um, um I'm probably gonna I probably would do this on a boss to be honest. Um we'll try it with this guy. Generally I just use bosses because then you don't have to worry about it doing too much damage. Especially if you have points in um agility. Okay, let's get a sword. Bum, 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 bum. So, two-handed sword for cripple. Sunder, cripple, bleed. Okay, so we only need to do one cripple. Uh, sunder. Sunder. Cripple. Your heavy attack will always apply the negative status effect. There we go. Sweet. There we go. Defeat reptilian monstrosities. Okay. Um, so those are the those are the things that look like rhinos. I always forget what they're called. Um Reptile. Um, reptile beast. If you spawn them in as a stack. He's fighting the, right, the mammoth. That's funny. There we go. Did that. There you go. Um... It. Defeat all purge waves. Squirrel. Okay. Craft a weapon modification. We could do that at home. In our Tinker's Bench. Hello, everybody. Welcome, people. Hello, Crescent. Hello. Just simple evening of Mammoth Abuse. Yes, indeed. -y. Yeah, we're just going to power through our Battle Pass um, XP multipliers and then move on to some other content. Um, right, Tinker's Bench, weapon modification. Tinker, Tinker, Tinker. Da -da -dum, da -da -dum. Tinker, 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 Tinker. So I like to do this once I've hit level 60. I don't like to do this admin stuff before then. Um, I could switch to a different playthrough. Um, but I don't know. I just kind of end up... I like to do it on my main playthrough, but I want to wait till level 60 so I don't gain anything from it. If that makes sense um so let's make something we're going to use anyway okay um i'm going to make uh, an advanced blunted fitting at some point to put on another seth truncheon i need some okay we need okay well in that case let's just spawn it in um hardened steel we will just drop it afterwards so that we're not like gaining anything there you go craft a weapon modification let me drop that chop that there we go achievement done plane reward kill members of the cult of dagon so these are the ones that you find in uh, the sunken city which i mentioned um it is possibly just easier it's probably just easier to go there quicker to go there so we're going to go to the boat that gives us access to the sunken city there we go we're going to interact with this boat this is where we are on the map in the jungle click on the boat and then before you go into the water there's a bunch of these cultist people how many do i have to defeat is it like five five it's usually five there we go bum 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 do 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 da, da, dum, bum. okay so there's a few people there's a bunch of people down here on the beach so we'll defeat those i don't even know what's hit them Perfect amount. Nice. Very convenient. Thank you for that. Legendary. Loads. Okay. Defeat all purge waves. Um, It's a kind of a time-consuming one. 
Craft an explosive. I'm going to claim that anyway. Craft an explosive. We can do that at home. I can't not click on the thing, peeps. Hello, Brega. Hello, hello. How are you doing? Hello, Renato. Hello. What is that about unicorns, Kel? <laughs> unicorns. Uh, craft an explosive. Okay, so let's make an explosive in our alchemist bench. Da -da -da. Do -do 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 -do. Fireball cauldron, I guess. Do I have the mats? Yes. Hopefully this counts. I feel like I go through this mental process every time it says explosive. Okay. Um, a jar. I need a jug for that. Um, I guess we'll do this. I'll just spawn in a jug. Earthenware. You can make it in an alchemy. Uh, what is it called? Artisan table if you need to. Uh, earthenware jug. And then craft an explosive. There we go. We'll put, put that in here. Okay. What next? Kill purge enemies. Reroll. Okay, we're going to stick to this. I'm going to just claim that because it's done. Uh, consumer Heart of a Hero. Easy. Admin. Heart of a Hero. You can get these from the Unnamed City mini bosses. Uh, Heart of a Hero. If you kill mini bosses in the Unnamed City, or the one that's in the Wine Cellar Dungeon, um, or the one that's in the Silver Mine, just eat the heart. There you go. It will clear your corruption. It lasts for nine, uh, 40 minutes. And it'll clear all your corruption. There you go. Kill sandstorm beasts. Okay. So for this, we're going to go to sand sweat ruin. I could spawn them in, but it's just so quick just to go there um, by teleporting. Here is sand sweat ruins. It's an important place on the map for the lore of the game. If you want to free yourself from the exiled lands, and I do have a video about that on my YouTube channel, um, then you need to come here for that, basically. So these are the sandstorm beasts. It's easier sometimes to do this than to try to remember what they're called in the in the game. This one's already busy. There we go. Two of two, perfect. There we go. Claim reward. Did I not get the XP for that? Defeat frost giants. Frost giants. I'm just gonna do it where I am because it's quick. Wildlife is important. Wildlife. Giant no armor. Spawn two in. So much easier to do it when they're still standing next to each other. If you actually draw aggro from them or you have a friend to, they'll stay close to each other. I'm going to do ten. Okay. Uh, in that case, let's do it with our friendos because it'll be quicker. Let's go here. Hello, Chibi. Hello, hello. Good, thank you. How are you? Hello, Zamel. Hello, Grail. Hello, hello. Um, how much of an impact do you think Chapter 3 will have on current saves? Would it be better to just start a new character? Uh, changes to Chapter 3. Um, so, the change... Let me just think. Obviously, okay, so PvE sieges. Uh, so, if you have built at the Savannah and you've built right next to the ruins of Almeria, then you might want to consider like moving your base because it's going to be very laggy around there once the PvE sieges start. Plus, you have to leave render range of that location um, and then come back again for it to rebuild itself. So, if people are built next to it and they don't leave their houses, there's going to be a problem with people trying to do PvE sieges. Uh, the second thing is going to be the tavern. Um, so you're going to collect a barkeeper from, from level one and upwards from a purge. And then you're able to build a bar and have people come and visit you. Um, cannibals are getting nerfed into the ground. Um, so if you've got loads of cannibals and you deleted all your other characters, um, think about maybe not doing that in future. Um, but otherwise there's no, you don't have to start a fresh playthrough. I like to do a fresh playthrough every chapter because I want to have like the full experience and honestly any excuse to, to be honest, because I love this game. Um, but no, I don't think you need to start a new playthrough. No, no. Um, hopefully the building stuff is all like, you know, working properly. They are bringing in some new build pieces into the game. Um, kind of like Northern Acer 
uh, Nordheimer kind of related stuff. So if you want to like start fresh, then by all means, um, I'm going to be doing like a northern build, definitely. Hope that answers your question. Um, hello, Stackvik. Hello. Um, dum, dum, dum. Very cold thinking of making soup to keep myself warm. Yes, I'm sorry to hear that. It is very cold outside today, but everybody's keeping warm. Come to Australia. That's it. We're all going to come stay, stay with you, mortal. It's too cold here right now. Uh, built there, and when I moved to the new location of found purges, wouldn't happen. Um, yeah, so purges won't happen if there isn't enough like free flat ground um, close enough to your base for them to pass to your front door. Um, although if you do have a lot of mods, Nefano, um, then maybe sometimes that can happen as well. Um, maybe Nefano would pay the fair. Yeah, Neff will pay the fair, don't worry. Something, yes. Too poor, bless you. We're, we're all going to go. We're going to like be little nomads and we'll travel to each other's like homes to deal with the weather. That's what we'll do. Um, okay, so let's get some frost giants in. We only need like eight, but heck, heck let's do ten. Wildlife, um, no armor. Five, ten. There we go. So fortunately, we have our friends standing right here. If you're in creative mode, you don't lose, you don't run out of stamina. There's no stamina cost. I'm just swinging my old hammer around. I don't get, I won't get stunned because I'm not really here as far as I'm concerned. I should have buffed myself actually. That's one thing I didn't do. It's so nice. You can just swing as if you're not here. There you go. Perfect. Did we get them all? Frost giants. Perfect. Visit the Forgotten City of Selha. Ah, oh, we've lost... Have we lost all our XP multipliers now? Yes. So no more multipliers anymore. We do have these, if you wanted to use those. Yeah. I might stop here then, peeps. Um, We could use these ones, but... Yeah. I might just wait for my XP multipliers to, to go up again. So let's see what we've gained. 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. Okay, cool. So we've got like 21 levels left to go. I'm not going to claim anything yet, um, probably. Um, what, have I, what have I not got yet? Um, bloody footprints, a saddle scorpion skin some free burning siege boulders i'll probably never use pretty carpet a nice statue oh my god mortal <laughs> freaking heck uh thank you so much oh my goodness um thank you for contributing kalendros it was kalendros why did i think it was mortal kalendros thank you for contributing 175 danish krona question mark to the G graphics card i couldn't even think of the word then thank you so much Thank you, lovely. I'm like, sorry, I'm a bit shocked. Goodness me. Not you. Sorry. You do like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> what happened there? Someone's hacked me. <laughs> Not that you're a cockney, obviously. Ah, oh, Kalendras. Thank you, lovely. Thank you so much. Um, So I haven't said anything because I don't like to like ask for stuff. I just like to just, dis I want you to just discover it by yourself. And then if you want to contribute, you can. But I'm British. I feel awkward asking for stuff. But I do have a 4070 Ti on the wish list for contributions. If you'd like to contribute to it and you can, by all means do so. Otherwise, ignore it and just hang out. And that's absolutely fine. I think it's just called Krona. Krona in English. Yes. Yeah. Well, it's because it says DKK or something. Um, is, is it wish list? Uh, there is a link on my about page if you want to have a look. But it is a contribution. Like, I don't know why that's not working. Yes, grinding out the back pass, indeed, yes. Kel, thank you for starting that off. 
Uh, yeah, I, di I, I didn't say anything because I didn't want to, I felt awkward. But yes, there you go. Uh, it just means crowns, that's what I call them when, sp when speaking English. Of course, this verse. Hello, lovely. How's it going? Hello, Patrick. Hello, hello. Uh, so, yes, thank you, Kel, for starting us off there. I really appreciate that. That's very nice of you. Um, or you can scroll down a little bit and there's a wishlist link. Yeah, there's a wishlist link on my uh, About page on Twitch. And there's one in my description box on YouTube if you're watching on YouTube. There you go. Yes, well, it's gotten to the point now where um, my my current graphics card isn't kind of living up to expectations. It's trying to do all the things, so I'll make some soup for you. Oh, yes, please do. That would be lovely. Um, and uh, Kevin, I'm all right for food at the moment. Thank you, lovely. I'm OK. Um, we have we have a Dane. We do have a Dane who's in there looking for cookies. Ah, oh, bless you. Here we have a wild Anna in a flustered state at a gift of generosity from one of the many turd wallets in her community. Her humbleness and gratitude are only outshone by her oh. ability to swear. Excuse me. Excuse me. I am unfamiliar with swear words, people. Thank you for the bits. Thank you, David Dutterman. Uh, Sir David <coughs> as well, Lucy. Thank you, lovely. Yes, I'm a bit shocked, but hey-ho. Thank you very much. That's very nice of you. Um, I had, yes, anyway... Right, let's drop all these things that we gave ourselves to kind of do the challenges. We'll resume this later. Um, I will keep the dragon horns because they were just on our friend. And then we'll resume the series, shall we? Let's get back inside. We'll get our stuff back from our boxes, which I have remembered are here. Yes, I take them all. Right, let's get our, our hot bar set up. Um, I did transmog. Um, so yesterday we did the wine cellar dungeon um, and we got the pristine Kari bow, which was always such a like a big, I don't know how to, what is the word? Sometimes I need words. <laughs> um, uh, prize, you know, a, a special thing to find, a big quarry. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Anyway, it's a beautiful bow. Um, I have transmogged it onto the Reach of the Red Mother for free because I have Fashionist, right? Now, normally I wouldn't transmog a pristine curry bow onto anything else because it's such a hard thing to get, or it was at least. I wonder if maybe they've increased the drop rate. Um, but we got it from Mini Boss in the, in the Wine Cellar Dungeon. And because I have Fashionist, I can just drag items onto here and their appearance will stay here. But I can just use the bow so you can transmog it and all your friends' items or whatever. Besides which, the Reach of the Red Mother, which we actually earned from killing the Red Mother in the Unib City, uh, does more damage anyway. Um, I did craft, oh, I did craft a Kari bow um, with a blade, uh, what is it called? A bow maker, uh, carpenter, uh, off stream. And it is very good, but it still isn't as good as the Reach of the Red Mother, which, um, so this Kari bow with the bow maker is 31 and 9%. And the Reach of the Red Mother, Reach of the Red Mother, I'll show you the pristine bow as well. I do have it in a box, but it's just quicker for me to spawn it in and show you. Um, let's compare them. So yeah, pristine Kari bow is 29 and 9. The crafted Kari bow with a bow maker is 31 and 9. Anonymous, thank you for contributing 70 euros towards the graphics card. Thank you very much. Oh my god. What is going on? Anonymous, thank you for the 50 pounds. I cut very small writing chat towards the graphics card. Thank you very much. Okay. <laughs> thank you very much. It's a generosity spree. Thank you, people. Oh, gosh. Never feel my brain just went blank because the spelling of awkward. We're here for you. Oh, bless you. It's an awkward, it's an awkward, yeah. How much is that crazy GP? It's a lot of money. It's a lot of money. Yeah. Thank you, people, so much for that. Goodness me. Anonymous. Oh, God. It's like, is it always in a different, um, different currency? Thank you for the other 50 currency um, towards the graphics. God is going on uh creston thank you for the 25 dollars towards the graphics card chat what are you doing stop it now making me feel like 
Oh my god. Kevin, thank you for the £50 towards the graphics card. Chat. <laughs> Are you going to make me cry in a minute? Okay, stop it, Anna. Behave yourself. Okay, anyway... So the Kari bow is 31 and 9. Pull yourself together, woman. Um, without any, like, special crafter, it's uh, 25 and 9. There you go. So it's, like, it's like good, but still the Reach of Red Mother's better. There you go. Perfect. This is a hard drop to get, though, from the Red Mother in the Unnamed City. Let's cry together. I know. Sure. Kevin uses pounds. I love that. Hell. Of course, someone's got to use pounds. Like a British person or something. Um... Love seeing Anna all flustered, bless you. Goodness me, thank you guys so much. That's insane. Anna now has to live with the English cognitive dis dissonance that she hates asking for things, but having having a call to action works. It is, yeah. That's it, yeah. Uh-huh. If you if you do use squeaky. But we use squeaky to wipe your eyes. The problem with that, Kevin, anybody with a cat here knows if you have any moisture on your hands or on your face, like if I have just moisturized my face, I pick my cat up and I'm like cuddling her like a little baby and I kind of kiss like on her shoulder or something, I immediately have cat fluff on my um, face and then it's just there until I wash my face again. So crying and wiping your face on a cat is a is a is a hiding to nothing or something. 50 Australian is like five pounds. Oh, bless you. Um, anyway, right. So where were we before all this craziness happened? Okay, so um, we got this sword here. Um, we're going to take our Delincia. Let's go to the unnamed city. Let's go murderify some fools. Um, let's get some heels on our hotbar. Calendros. What is that? What is that currency? Thank you for the 116 currency. Sad to donate is a run of currency. Thank you, lovely. You are a loon. I do appreciate you. Thank you so much for the generosity. Goodness me. Okay, right. Let's get our Delincia, who I asked to dance earlier, but she refused to, and now she's dancing um, because I stopped dancing. Well done, lady. Bravo, bravo. Okay, follow me. Uh, let's give her some pork. Um, she's going to chew through a lot of food. Um... I've been very prepped before streams recently, haven't I? I'm feeling good about it. I think it's since I tidied up in this base. Um, right, dragon horns, where should we dump those? In the sorcery box, mayhaps. Uh, sorcery, sorcery, sorcery. There we go. Okay. Excellent. Are we ready? I have. Do you know what? I've missed the unnamed city. We've really barely been there this playthrough. Um, where's my little horse, friendo? Oh my goodness. Uh, BJ, thank you for contributing $15 towards the graphics card. Thank you, lovely. Thank you very much, people. Goodness me, what have you started, Calendros? Um, I can't find anything in this place. It's too big. Right, let's get a horsey. Did I prep you? Yes, the horse is prepped. It's got vines for healing, um, some extra food for Delincia when she chews through those exotic feasts, some extra heals, which she'll, she'll use as well. Um, we're all good to go, right? Um, let's give her a strength buffing potion black lotus and then let me just get some spares actually a couple maybe mayhaps um and today i really want to focus on trying to get a shield right or just just all our crafting tools so uh black lotus um we might as well um do the map room today as well like at the end of the playthrough isn't that funny yes okay Awesome source. Right, we're in a medium weight class here. We're like level, uh, we're in very, very high level um, agility buffing armor. It also will buff her damage as well. She's going to hit like a freaking unit. It's going to be a lot of fun after using a named bearer. Is everybody ready? Should we head off to the unnamed city? Let's do it. I'm not in creative exit creative mode. Oh, I need to eat my buffs as well. Um, Elixir of Grace and salted exquisite meat the place is too big anna complaining about her place being too big maybe maybe you should have put up a 4090 oh i couldn't i'd have to get a new power supply and stuff um Rixie for that 79 has become a member ah uh, Rixie, thank you so much for becoming a member on the youtube channel thank you so much for that i appreciate the support thank you thank you goodness me so nice of you 
Uh, yeah, 4090 would require um, a bigger power supply and I'd have to worry about heat as well. I feel like my system, my, I have a 750 watt power supply so it could cope with the 4070, but um, yes. Sometimes has a treat stream thing up and Kevin usually gets the food. Yeah, yeah, but I'm like good. I just ate, I'm good. I don't know, I was looking for cookies. It's your fault for not having anything. Oh, thank you, Kel. You're so lovely. Spanish doubloons, is that what it was? Oh my goodness. Um, oh my. Oh my goodness. Grail, thank you for contributing $100. Holy shit. I saw the big bag of nuts, but they are sold out. <laughs> I'm like, honestly, how far away are we now? This is insane, people. Bum, 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 bum. 36%. Crikey. Close. Go away, friendo. Goodness me. Um, Don't swear. Never. I swear. Never in my life, chat. Honestly. Seriously. Goodness me. Crikey. All right. Thank you very much, people. Okay. Anyway, as we were, as we were, let's go, let's go. Um, yes, food, 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 food. Crikey. Um, yes, salted exquisite meat. We do have some of that. I don't need all of this. Let's take five of those. I need elixirs of grace. Do I have pork? I have pork. We've got food for her. Um, where the frick are the fridges? Okay, I'm, God, this is why we need to, portals, people. We need like Valheim portals to get around. Um, oh, for Cardi Grail, <laughs> bless you. Thank you, lovely. That's so kind of you. Um, some footy notes is also good water cool day. I own it for PSU with your season. I think it's good. Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah, but that's like absurd amounts of money. Um, oh, God. Why? What? The chat. Chat. Hold on a second. I'm like thrown, thrown off. Okay. Um, Elixir of Grace. Oh, wait. I feel like I crafted a bunch here. There's two here. I think I have a bunch in a box as well. Yeah, we got more in a box. Okay, so let's eat an elixir of grace. Let me leave creative mode. Uh, two of those. And I've got my food. All right, let's eat our salted it's crispy. Okay, super. Okay, is everybody ready? Is everyone into the bathroom? Has everyone got their shoes on? Let's go to the unnamed city. Let's go modify some bosses. Level up our Delincia. Take over the world. Kill Philip and whatnot. If you haven't seen Shaun of the Dead and your name is Philip, don't be scared. It's a film. <laughs> it's a reference. Um, portals are the orange and blue. Do they come with sassy computer that constantly insults you? Oh, long live Carter, yes. Um, uh, mech links, thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Um, don't understand why the 1490 doesn't come with a hot water heater function. Just run the cooling tubes. Do you know what? It's funny as well. I mean, running my PC in the winter is quite helpful, honestly. Um, definitely playing, uh, what's it called? Playing Cun. <laughs> what is this game called? That is kind of helpful, yes. Right, let's go to the unnamed city. We're probably going to level her up the first level on the way because she's going to kill some random goat or something, isn't she? She can't help herself. If I get, if I kill this ostrich, oh, right, okay, bonus points if I can hit an ostrich. Okay, I'm going to kill this ostrich just by trampling. Okay, Delincey is going to kill an ostrich. There you go, get your first level, there you go. She just did 472 damage in one hit. I love that. Oh yeah. Let's go, peeps. How many points is she going to, how many like uh, levels is she going to get just before we even get to the unnamed city, I wonder. Oh, happy Friday and December 1st. Yes, happy December the 1st, people. When are you... Right. When is it an appropriate time to put up decorations? Are you already decorated? Are you like, there will never be any decorations? Or are you like, let's wait a couple of weeks? How do you stand? Um, let's go. This is a triumph. She and my sister's a Seasonic and there's people on the course there. Seasonic, uh, 1600 watt. Mm-hmm. Tizio started the emu war and is already doing better than Australia. Are they like um, an invasive species? Are there too many emus in Australia? I wasn't aware of that. 
new meaning to cosy games, although I don't think most people would call Conan a warm cosy game. Do you know, for me, it is a cosy game. Because, um, and like, so I do love Ark, and by the way, if you're like wondering, I will return to Ark as well. But I feel like this game is, is one of the cosier survival games. It has that cosy aspect. You can like make a nice house, you have your dancers and your like pets and stuff, and you can have like a little white rabbit if you've got that Twitch drop at the time, you know. 23rd, yes, 23rd is it. You're going to pop up the tree and then it's going to be down again before the end of Christmas Day. Uh, we sell Christmas trees, really? Ah, oh, I bet you. Oh, I love the smell of a real Christmas tree. So it smells so nice. Um, I live alone in a big house. I put minimal decor up tonight. Ah, oh, that's nice. I live with a cat who likes to like mess with stuff. So I don't know if I'm going to do much decorating. I shall never decorate butts. I mean, butt spot. Don't shame people if you want to decorate the butts. Do you know what I'm saying? Uh, what behind the rabbit? What it is the rabbit. Oh my God. Um, I'm an American. Lights stay up uh, all year long. All year long. Ah, oh, bless you. Uh, Tend to say I'll do it December first and then forget for the next two weeks. Yeah, hello, mortal. Yeah. Yep. 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 Uh, so probably working in the pub they decorate two weeks ago. Yeah. So I used to work in retail. And um, I remember think like we would have Christmas music super early and then we would have to put on the sale uh, on Christmas Eve. So we would take down all the Christmas decorations on Christmas Eve and we would put up like New Year sale stuff before we left. So it's like Christmas was over before Christmas had even happened. Um, so, yeah. Um, have two cats. Ah, too much work for me to decorate. Yeah. Day after, day after Thanksgiving, really. Ah. Got an 8.50 now to make sure I can run. Oh, right. So wait, what did you have before, Kel? Wasn't it a CPU you needed to get? Hard spell. Yeah, I, 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 I can understand you writing. Don't worry, Patrick. Oh, we're already here. Um, Shall we start our usual location? To do things in the proper order. There's a quote from Holy Grail when they run across the vicious rabbit. I see. I've known not. I've learned not to question um, your references, Nefanor, because generally I have a memory like a sieve and don't necessarily remember things. Oh, okay. I was like, are we going to be able to stay on? Oh, I felt like I, I hurt myself a second time. Then, right. Let's get to the beginning of uh, the unnamed city. Get to the first boss. Hello, Ecliptic. Hello, hello. Oh my. Is Brian going to read that? Brian? Brian? Question mark. Is he not going to read stuff? What is going on? Hold on a second. Sorry, let me like look that up in a second because... Um, Stop it. Stop it. Delincia, modify. Uh, Grail, thank you so much for that tip. I don't know why Brian didn't read your message. Um, can you hear the clicking when I type, by the way? As in, like... Squirrel! Uh, what is it called? Recently, my keyboard has started like making little clicking noises on the headphones. It's kind of cool. I like it. It's like ASMR. Um, uh, thanks to Anna and her fabulous team of mods for such a nice community. Thank you, lovely. Why didn't Brian read it? Brian? Are you sleeping? Is Brian on the room today? Alert box. Hmm. I know this is like the most exciting thing I could possibly do while streaming, but um, why is Brian not reading stuff? Text to speech. Disabled. What? Include message. Yes. Okay. Brian was disabled in text to speech for some reason for for tips. I don't know why. That's weird. Anyway, thank you so much for that. That was very sweet. Thank you very much. Thank you, lovely. Thank you, guys. 
Um, okay, we're at the unnamed city. Let's start with the first boss that I usually fight. Let's get let's get this Dillinsia leveled up. Let's see if we can find some goodies. Uh, drop rates have improved in the unnamed city. Now you seem to get a legendary item um, from every boss kill, except maybe the bat. I feel like the bat doesn't always give you something. Have I? Am I buffed? I guess they're just like. We could bring like spectre coating. Um, you can use uh, one of the spectre coated legendaries when you come to this place. Look how. Oh my goodness. It is so nice when you switch from um, a named bearer to a Delencia Snow Hunter or a Berserker or something because the same gear that makes the bearer bearable. <laughs> Ruffle. I'll go to the corner. Don't mind me. Definitely put the oven on. Um, yeah, it makes her like amazing. Okay, we got the war war dancer chest piece. 6% strength weapon damage. This is awesome. And it's light armor. And it just looks exactly like the Zamorian. I'm going to drop that because I hate you. Um, repair kits. It just looks exactly... Yeah, there you go. It just looks exactly like the, um, the dancer outfit. But it's a legendary and it gives 6% uh, strength damage. It's a nice drop. I didn't bring any water. Chat. Okay, let's just see if we get water or some f snacks that will feed us and fill our waters up. Nothing interesting in the box. Hello, Biscuit. Hello, hello. How are you doing? Brian, he's not the best. <laughs> he's a very naughty boy. He is a very naughty boy, definitely. Um, I'm not in, like, funny modes. No, I'm in... We're okay. Bum, bum, ba -dum, bum, 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 bum. Ooh. Right, I guess we take purple lotus because we can use that to craft our purple lotus orbs. Bum ba -dum -bum. Yeah, spectre coating would be really cool on this weapon right now, wouldn't it? I'm trying to figure out how long it takes these snake eggs to respawn. I would assume it would be like 15 minutes, like everything else. Is it taking longer? Taking everyone upstairs to make lunch leftover mac and cheese and corn dogs. Wow, that sounds very nice. And I was big time struggling with the dark. I'm struggling to feel awake. Valentin? Yes. I feel like every single stream I've done for the, at least the last two weeks, I my brain just has not been working properly. Absolutely. I'm very, I'm very affected by seasons. In the spring, I'm like excitable, hyperactive, giddy, chatty, ruffle. And then as soon as like, it's like mid-summer. It's not even like the end of summer. My brain like, I get this like feeling of foreboding. And then, yeah, there you go. Look how fast we killed him. Good job, lady. Okay, we've got the shank daggers. Cripple and bleed from those. Some, I'm just, yeah, I'm, I'm just like not looking at repair kits. Excuse me, I don't care about you. Uh, what are the most looking forward to in, the, what are most looking forward to in the next stage of what update? Pers yeah, let's ask everybody that. What are you looking forward to most in the next update? Um, I'm personally looking forward to, to the sea, uh, the tavern the most, um, mainly because of what that promises for the future. Um, the new barkeeper that you get at the end of, um, purges from rescuing from cages at the end of a purge from a level one. Um, and then you're able to craft a bar and have people show up, which you can, you can hire. Um, it's a new way of getting thrills and it promises kind of things for the future. Would you get up there, you fool? Right. First of all, we'll put you up and away. There you go. Let's get our free relic fragment. Right, so I have steel feud. So I shouldn't be afraid of this lady now. Don't I? Double checks. Yes. Let's just wallop this lady. Hi! So it will not save me against her fire attack. Okay. How much damage Zelensky is doing? I feel like Delincia will be my favourite thrall uh, once again from next chapter. Bum, ba -dum, bum. She always will be, let's face it. There we go. <laughs> that was so quick. That was awesome. I love it. 
So we got Blade of Seven Winds, which is the 100% armor, armor pen katana that is dropped by the Red Mother. It's a very good weapon. It does 33 damage, but it does entire, like 100% armor pen. So there you go. Cool. If you're into katanas and whatnot. I'm going to leave the rest. Um, what else do I want to get from her? Do I care about the other stuff? I guess we'll get the dragon bones and the horns. Why not? I don't have um, I don't have a bearer with me though, so I'm going to drop all the other stuff. Um, oh, I hate not having a bearer, Delincia. Um, what do they weigh? Eighteen. They weigh six. Should really have like. Can I? Fill up your foods. Bum, bum, bum. Kind of want horses to have like an extra row. That'd be kind of cool. Bum, bum, bum. Um, I don't care about this. Volatile glands you should probably keep. You know what I'm saying? Do, 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 do. Right, let's go. Let's go, people. I don't have any water. Am I going to have to spawn water in? Just because I forgot it, like an idiot. Pull the lever. Tavern sounds awesome, but each update has brought a pleasant surprise. That's what I'm looking forward to. Hmm. Now that they fixed the camels, I am very much looking forward to riding around on a camel, I have to say. Aren't they making camels rideable? Camels have more slots than a tier 3 bearer. Uh, they are making them rideable. The ones that you can ride don't have as many slots currently. Or oh, they didn't when I looked on the beta. Um, but I think they were talking about increasing the slots because I feel like if you're going to have a camel, it should be uh, instead of a horse, then it should be better in some way. It should have some differentiation or some in incentive to use them, apart from just they being kind of funny and cool. That was a quick kill. We're going to destroy, aren't we? Kind of feel like doing all the dungeons, honestly. go excellent work she's just so quick um not even gonna pick up the coins i will get these though because it's quick let's get out of here um did i loot you okay so we got a chess piece um mini bosses so obviously enemies in the age of war chapter two have a chance to drop the armor that they're wearing you can get these silent legion items which give you a lot of heat protection so if you want to go to the volcano if you kill these guys, you can get up to two pieces. I've definitely gotten up to two pieces from them. And it'll buff your strength. It's heavy armor. It's a great drop. It's kind of broken, honestly. Maybe. Question mark. Should fly, like, in the beta? Oh, it was very funny. Am I going to have to spawn in purified? Listen, just assume I took water with me when I left the, the pyramid. <laughs> there you go. Just because otherwise, what would we do? We'd have to go home or run to the beach or something. Relic hunters live in the desert. It would make sense if they dropped. It would make sense if they... Thank you, Kevin. Absolutely. Um, should be slower, but more carry capacity. Yeah. I kind of don't want to go slowly. I think if they were slower, I just pe people just wouldn't use them. I don't know. Moving slowly is like... Oh, God. It's not good, is it? Da -da -dum. Do -do -do -do. Dum -da 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 so we did also get a heart of a hero from that mini boss as well and if that will last for 40 minutes and then it will clear all of our corruption the whole just by eating it once and like things like cleansing brew which have to eat a bunch of to clear lots of instances of corruption so i generally will do the rat like the route around this place and then after i reach the final section that will corrupt me on my route that's when i would eat the heart of a hero more salted exquisite meat. That's good. I guess we'll take that while we're over. We're already over our medium weight class. Hi there, sir. Ooh, she's beating him up. Look at that, 900 in that one hit. Maybe what we should be doing is enjoying our cannibal brute while he's still good. Uh, what do we get? Corrupted Axe. So this will corrupt the, an enemy in PvP if you're playing against other people. Otherwise, it doesn't really do that much for us in PvE. 
Um, you can take these radium gem, uh, radium gems and use them to make radium torches, which are really cool torches that you can put a dye into and change the colour of the light. Um, and they also don't have any... what's the word? They don't have an animation, so they're a bit better on server performance. Um, if you want to... you can have like a nice warm red colour or like a nice blue or green, anything you want. Are you in the ground, sir? I'm just going to run past him. I'm going to ignore the um, box there. There's a box in that boot thing. If you climb up, drop down. I've shown you in every single playthrough. I don't care about repair kits anymore, so I'm not going to go for it. I'm like... We've got beef, me and repair kits. <laughs> She's melting the way so yes. Uh, Endercraft, thank you for the follow. Um, chat distracted Anna. Made her forget. That's it. Yes, thank you very much. That's very generous of you, Kevin. Yes, chat distracted me by being incredibly generous. Yes. That's it. Dum, da, dum, dum, dum. So we picked up our free fragment off the ground next to the green dragon. The green dragon has no loot table, doesn't drop a skeleton key, doesn't drop legendaries, armor, anything like that. So I never fight them. Um, if you need extra dragon bones or horns and things, by all means, kill it. Uh, they'll drop cooked leather as well. They won't drop volatile glands because they don't breathe fire. Um, but they're definitely worth killing if you want that loot. I don't care about that loot, so we're just going to run past like I always do. And we're going to make our way up here to this boss up on the high ground. Which is kind of tough to get to if you were running a corrupted build. This is where we are. Quite often I get chased by a, an archer. Which I need to deal with before I climb. So if you take any damage when you're climbing, there he is, then you will fall. There we go. Crimson Lotus Powder, I'll take. I can use that to craft my Elixirs of Grace. Keep it dying. You can get dragon bones from the little babies as well, but we're good for that. We've already made our dragon ribs for our lady friend. Um, we will craft a bunch of um, a bunch of her armour for when we do purges. We're going to do like a bunch of purges. I'll probably build like a little purge base. Oh my goodness! Kevin. Kevin underscore H underscore 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 contributed 150 pounds towards Gigabyte GeForce RTX. Tilda sent via throne.com. Holy potatoes. Kevin, thank you so much. That's very generous. Thank you for the contribution towards the graphics card. Holy crap. My character isn't able to climb. I'm glad I fixed the TTS as well. Uh, I'm about to allow that one. I'm going to go back from the doctor so I didn't know what an HD is. But he's got 80 of them. He's got 80 of them, suckers. Oh, God, I'm going to have to work out what that means, Valentin. Got back from the doctor. He said he doesn't know what an HD is. Oh, ADHD? Is that what that is? Did I work it out? Kevin, thank you so much again. That is a huge support. Thank you, everybody, so much. 18 HD. 80. ADHD, right? No? Did I work it out? Feels relevant. Green, green dragon is a bad dragon. It is a bad dragon. It's a waste of the uh, waste of effort, really. Wasted durability of your legendaries. Goodness me. Hi, sir. You want to fight me over here? I can't believe that. Stop it. Get him, Delincia, or Big D, as I always call her. I'm just like a support person again now. I used to be like the tough one. Now she's like shaming me with my flimsy wrists. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? That was fast. Fast as fudge. Okay, quick. So can I just compare this to... Um, let's take this crystalline, uh, lotus burn, I think. Can I compare this to our jar's bane? Bum, 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 bum. Crikey. Thank you so much, everybody. Seriously. Uh, Arja's Bane that you can get from a uh, legendary chest does 60 damage, 28% armor pen, and has executioner ability. This takes the final 10% of any enemy's health. It's really particularly useful for bosses. I don't really care about executioner that much. Some people like it. There you go. Quake does 67 damage and 27 armor pen. So more damage. Seven more damage, one less armor pen. And all it does is sunder. Uh, they have the same durability, they weigh the same, they're both strength weapons, 
So there you go. We have an Arjas, at least one Arjas Bane at home. Um, so probably uh, Arjas Bane will probably do better for bosses, right? Just because of that final 10% hit. Um, yes. And this one, Quake, would be better just for, like running around with. Okay, I'll drop Arjas Bane. I'm going to drop this axe because I'm not going to use it. Um, I'm going to drop that because I can't carry it. Okay. Ooh, onwards. Help myself to cookies. Did I get it right, Valentin? Is that what it's supposed to be? ATHD. I think that works better if you have an, an accent. Excuse me, we're Americans. We don't have an accent. Yes. Still did you with a British accent, I didn't know. Um, then the hard way to never use golems against these bosses. They have star metal weapons and they melt golems. Yeah. I had that problem when I took a golem to Mounds of the Dead when I had my first, like... What was he called? Princess Bubblegum. <laughs> and um, we took him to Man's of the Dead. He got absolutely deleted by some Sumerians. It was, it was bad times. She says, I know I'm laughing, but it was it was pretty awful. Yeah. I think, did we make a shrine? Let's assume we did. In my mind, we made a shrine. And da 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 the other day, an alpha snake owned the green dragon, then Sand Reaper Queen, then Giant Asserta, all in the same general area on Sipta, really? Um, so you're talking about... You're talking about on the Isle of Dawn. Yeah, I know where you're talking about. I tried to build there on my Sipta playthrough. Um, should we go fight the snake? Let's do it, people. Let's be feisty. You got it. Nice. Good, good, good. Quakles has a secret perk in PvP. It makes enemy... It shakes enemy screens, does it? Is it bugged? I'm going to use my Baltius razor in here because it's better for snakes on the ground. Just a bit easier to hit them. I'm going to have that stuck in my head all day now. Dum, 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 dum. Bum, 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 bum. bum, 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 bum. I could turn on the torch, couldn't I, really? I don't know how I feel about these places being so dark, really. I think it's fine for, like, normal gameplay. But because I'm streaming, I just... Darkness is like the enemy. Go on, snakey. Would you not hit me, please? Hit my Delintia, she'll murderify you. She's doing a lot of damage to him, look at that. Look at that. 947 in one hit there. This guy is a thrall killer. If you take a thrall who doesn't do a lot of damage, doesn't have a lot of armor, or doesn't have uh, poison resistance or curative, please don't go into the wall. Nice. I like it when it doesn't disappear. Get my torch out. Do a bit of healing up. What's she up to? Level seven already. All right, let's get our skeleton key from this friendo. I probably should have done war party and brought my bearer as well, you know, to level her up. So I could just, he could just carry all the things. Um, you can use this uh, venom gland to make uh, poison for your weapons and stuff. Um, let's gather, right, let's check first for the fragment back here. I feel like we're just having like a fun day today because we've been working through all the, the dungeons. Today I really want to just do like, I want to do the unnamed city. I want to go find some crafters. Just like do Conan stuff, you know. All the usual things. Notice that Q is just horizontal flip of D. Oh my goodness. Mind blown. Dum da 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 dun. Do 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 do. Dum da da da. Let's loot these chests, steal all the cash. So I am gonna do a solo series. I don't know when to do it. Shall I do it? How right, how would you feel about it? Because I will do a fresh playthrough every chapter. Chapter three, shall I do it as a solo challenge? What do you think, peeps? Entirely so, no fighter thralls at all for any of it. What do you think? Type one if that you think that's a good idea. Type two if you want me to just do like a normal like guided playthrough. Busy or type or, or if you have another suggestion, write that in the chat. <clears throat> one. It's all so, it is dark, isn't it? Um, you said, you said bum and it wasn't even a bot bum. Oh my goodness. 
Um, I'm an Australian in the US and discovered I'm the only person here without without an accent. I love that. That's funny. Um, one. Lots of ones. Okay. Having thralls changes the game pretty significantly. Yeah. So crafters, yes, but no fighters. I will have crafters. I will, like, knock people out for that. Uh, bearers are carriers, not fighters. You can have a bearer. Ba bearers uh, will fight, though. So it would be no... Um, so I will have a horse um, and... And I will get, uh, what is it called? Crafters and things. Hello, sir. Um, but I'll do it, like, completely solo. I've been meaning to do it for a while. That sounds pretty decisive. I'd say instead of bearers, and I should use animals for bearers. The only thing is I don't want anybody fighting for me. You know what I mean? 42 is not an acceptable answer either, Nefanor. Although you probably got into some graces with Kalendros. If only temporarily. This guy bleeds and poisons, so we could use our, like, saber knives on him. Uh, which is a disease and bleed dagger. It's kind of cool. I really want those gouging daggers we had on the last playthrough. They were really cool. This guy is my one of my favourite uh, must-fight creatures in the unknown city because he drops the riptide spear which gives you indefinite breathing underwater that's about it he does drop a bunch of other stuff he drops a black feather helm he drops vermin hide boots and pants uh which are oh. what do they do these days is it health vermin vermin hide boots and pants uh agility and health agility and health there you go six percent um, not a lot of armor value um, and there are other arbors that give you this amount of agility um, that you can craft and repair like the ranger armor the black corsair armor these also give you health so cool um, and but you can't repair them so because they're legendaries can you put the bearer on passive I, I could put the bearer on passive that is an option but I do think having a tank with you um I mean, I could have them, like, I could turn off the Irritate perk. Um, I don't know. But I, I feel like having somebody to draw aggro is not is not solo, right? The Riptide, yes, especially after the buff. Very, very handy. Do-do-do-do-do-do. Sorry about the Christmas singing. It's chat's fault. That's right. Gather ye. Um, not really HD, never really had a use for Riptide. You do the Dagon dungeon without any kind of breath potion, though the last time was very tight. I mean, you can do it without anything, but I don't, I like not, I love putting the Riptide in my hand and just swimming and like being relaxed, taking my time, looking around, looking at the little fish, looting the, the boxes and stuff, you know? Um, I prefer the breathing potions to the uh, mask. Look at this loot. This is so much better. Than Look at this. Full durability. Hard and steel pick. Star metal pickaxe. Hard and steel short sword. Like, you could just run over to this guy. I mean, you'd have to not... Look at that! She's already killed him. I haven't even got a chance to get, a, like, a look in. Oh, lady, you're such a god. Um, Spectre coating. Really, really handy for the... Uh, what's it called? I named city because lots of undead creatures here. It's a debuff that works on undead creatures. So we could just start putting that on our like agility weapons. Um, there is, is there a spectre coating agility weapon? I don't think, hmm. There's definitely gouging that you can get on, uh, definitely a pike, definitely some daggers. And that is like a, it's a bit like bleed, but not quite as good as bleed. It doesn't ramp up the same way as bleed stacks do um hello dave how you doing and whatever you want to thank you very nice um 
still a nice thing to have. Yeah. Uh, I like the look of that one. It's like it's made out of a spine. Which one? What's, what looks like it's made out of a spine? I've only got a small break between meetings. Still got to stay. Oh, working, looking. Sorry, we're taking a stretch, people. Take care, everyone. I shall return to my duties of real life. All right, lovely. Thank you for being here. Drink some wet era. Spectre Spain. Mmm. There's a short sword with with spectre coating on it. Is there? And soup is ready. Oh, enjoy. Ah. Uh. Dun, 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 dun. What's it called? I can spawn it and look at it. So one thing I really want is more one-handed agility weapons. Uh, I feel like, you know, you're agile, you're running around, you're very quick and everything. You kind of expect to have more choice with one-handed weapons. I would really like an agility axe, war axe. And then I will be basically Anna of yesterday, <laughs> running around with my strength stuff with the nimbleness of an agility person, but just using all my strength gear. Do you know what I'm saying? That would be like, that would be me really happy. Give me an agility war axe or something, or something else, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, one-handed, because you need a, um, or alternatively, um, more agility weapons with like, some agility weapons with like um, a light source. Oh, I was thinking about this yesterday because we do have, um, we do have the light arrow, don't we? So we could use that. Uh, do we want to do anything else while we're here? We've got 10 fragments. Let's go see if we can get any good recipes from the East library. Um, hello, Sir Devilish. Hello, hello. Good morning to you. Uh, just get your co-workers to watch on a stream. Then we'll get addicted and no more work needed. Ah, oh, that's very sweet. Tank, a tank, a healer and a DPS and a bring the wow. To Conan, love it, yeah. I have a hard time with that. Most of the people I coordinate with are still in office. Oh, you can do a playthrough with only friends you get from from the tavern. Ooh, that's a good one. Hmm. We need an axe. We have the Tulwar of Amir Kurum, Black Dragon Pike, and Vaulting Pole. Yes. Yeah. The Tulwar is a is an agility. Sh uh, is that agility these days? One handed sword. Jersey War Axe. Yeah, just got on the axe trip hype train and I love the moveset. Yeah, I love War Axes for groups of skeletons and um, what is it called? Uh, NPC camps. Yep. I don't know why I thought that was pick up a ball for a second. It's just very white looking and fresh. Um, Are we going to track the adventurer thingy? Am I in the right place for the first piece? Acquire a piece of knowledge. Mm, we're going to start off in Sepamru. Okay. So this is the Library of Esoteric Artifacts next to the Archivist. I have shown him before, but um, you can learn Memory of Oils for five fragments of power. This will allow you to craft the Oil of Bounty, Oil of Agony, Oil of Concussion, Oil of Penetration. Um, bounty adds uh, a lot of uh, yield, uh, increases the yield of your uh, tools. Uh, agony, extra damage, p penetration, extra armor pen. And then all of concussion, obviously extra concussive damage to a trench and things like that. He looks like he's like standing in a funny pose. It's also like glitching out a little bit. Anyway, he also teaches you cartographer so that you can learn how to make a map room, which we will maybe do today. Um, I've already learned it from him. But this is the Library of Esoteric Artifacts. Um, here, you can see, oh, I've got like, I'm like slightly hideous because of all the uh, sorcery. Um, uh, the corruption. What was I going to say? If you have fragments of power in your inventory and you click E on this wall, you'll be granted a scroll. They now should ne we should never get the same thing twice because they've changed it as of uh, for chapter two. Did I get two then? No, it's just like a crossover. So we're just going to click. Okay, so we've we've run out of them. This is cool. Battle spatula, dead leg. Essence of Rot, Havoc and Malice. That is uh, uh, dual wielding axes, but it's really daggers, isn't it? Question mark. A kiln, which is like a small furnace, very small. Petrified Gag, which is just decorative. 
Reinforced stool is a weapon. I think, yes. Superman statues, just what it sounds like. You can find these on the Exod lands now from the enemies in the volcano. Is it the volcano people? Where did I see them? I think it's from the volcano. Um, Venom infused two-handed sword. I love these weapons because you don't have to reapply your, your damage. Personally, I really like the war axe and the daggers more than anything else. Or the pike. Uh, whirlwind blades. Sorceress spell page. Okay, we already had that. Okay, sweet. Let's go, peeps. Let's drop our stuff home. And then we're going to go on a crafting thrall hunt. Havoc and is up is a fun double axe weapon. Yeah, but isn't it just the same um animation as daggers is it not just technically daggers serpent sword has one hand axe move set with acidic it's not the best but it's the great axe great value axe for agility okay let me get out of here and i will have a look bum, 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 bum. Da, 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 da. da 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 do, 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 do. Come on, horsey. Let's move, people. Mm -hmm. So that's the only thing about travelling around with the Delincia, um, is we don't have all that storage space from the bearer. Um, if we were just going to level her up, then I would probably just do War Party. Um, so we could have both the bearer and Delincia at the same time. So she could do the damage, he could just carry stuff. Um, volcano people have that's it in their pockets their pockets are bigger on the inside yeah they're like a Mary Poppins like bags or a, an undetectable extension charm or something from Harry Potter what dual axis swords have their own attack animations do they I haven't used them for a while maybe the ember like modern running hmm it's just been a while since I've used them um, can I just get far away enough from these people he's gonna forget about us He's not going to run this far. You'll get bored. Sir? There you go. What was the serpent thingy? This one. Serpents. Uh, yes. So where did we get... Where do we get this one? Um... Um, serpents, blah 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 blah. Stygian Sanctuary of the Serpent or the Snake Bone Vault. Oh, it's a scepter weapon. So, is it now on Exiled Lands? Is it because a lot of scepter stuff has been brought to Exiled Lands? It's acidic. Um, they have the one-handed axe throwing axe animations. Let's try the... Um, what is it called? Havoc and Malice. Keep doing this. Havoc. Just doing this so I can move whilst um, over encumbered. Oh yeah, so they do. They do. This is an axe animation. So when I use my left click, it's like I just have one axe, and then if I use my right click, oh yeah, okay, okay. So this is like when I put. Um, this is like when I put a throwing axe in one hand. I remember doing this. It's like a. Windmill of windmill of bones reminds me of like Greg Davis. Um, to make some of those, yeah, it is kind of cool, isn't it? It's like I am the danger. Obviously, we would run out of uh, stamina before this time. So crafted with no thrall, it's forty three damage and no armor pen, and obviously they bleed. Don't have a lot of durability with no thrall, but you could make them with a temper smith, or I would make them with a bladesmith so they do more damage. Cool. Oh, and they're both on your back. That looks very cool, yeah. 
All right. I feel like in the past, maybe they did like, um, um, they just had the same animation um, as a, as daggers. I don't know. I may be wrong. They've changed things a lot recently. Nice crowd control. Yeah, fair. I really like, this is what I really like about war axes generally, like the one handed war axe is the crowd control. Very handy. Uh, which seven days did I, my second favourite open world to have a game would take some pointers from cutting even more variety of enemies and weapons desperately. Hmm. Yeah. How many of you play seven days? It is on my list of things to do. I might do like one stream on it. No promises about anything past that. <laughs> because it, I do own it and I, I would like to, I would like to play it at some point. I tried it very briefly on, um, shall I eat this heart of a hero before it expires? There we go. Um, I did play it very briefly on PlayStation with a friend and I was kind of nervous about the impending horde night. Is he cook? Whirlwind blades, agility, double blades. Yeah, so what I'm looking for is one-handed agility weapons and um, what else? Things with spectre coating that are like agility as well. Um, played seven days, it's fun. Played it on and off, it's not bad, but don't like zombie games much. Yeah, I, I kind of think it might be one of those things that is just better with other people, perhaps. For the Undead Legacy overhaul mod these days, Vinna's going in little places. Mm -hmm. Do you not like the new learn by looting skill system? Mm -hmm. I watched the Neebs guys um, cinematic series and freaking loved it. I mean, I love most of the things they do. Um, but I, yeah, and that made me try it. So I do feel like I understand the game a bit, but never really played it properly. You play seven days, do you? Ah, most of our mod, Quarterstaff, has a, my favourite animation. Does it? Um, does it have like a magical kind of, does it do like twirl the blade or something? Um, last time, last I checked, Seven Days was way behind on console, wasn't it right? Yes, so that, I remembered that. Um, um, I remembered that being a thing. Seven Days just wasn't getting updated at all. And the PC version being very different. Good news on that front console version is finally getting updated to be on par with PC. Is it? Is it? Did I? Wait, remind me. Is that because people are people having to buy a newer version of it? Do you have to buy it again? Which game is making you buy the game again? Okay, oh, I'll come see. <laughs> Let's dump our stuff at home. Right. Um, armor can go away. Oh yeah, I placed the fashionist uh, bench there so I could hide my friend's helmet. Okay, war dancer can go there. And then weapons. Over here. Okay, hammers and maces. Um, swords. Yes. Yeah, I really want, like, uh, this is one of my favourite weapons in the game, or was before, uh, I guess, Age of War. Um, before when I was using strength builds, I absolutely love Festering One. It was the one thing I was always trying to get. Um, now, like, this damage, this durability goes down really quickly. Um, I guess, with the amount of hits I do to kill somebody. Whereas with my hammer, I just have to hit people, like, once or twice. Um... As a factor, I guess. Yeah, but I really need agility one-handed weapons. Um, I just don't like short swords, really. Um, yeah. Oh yeah, we spawned this in, so I didn't drop this. But yeah, um, what is the animation on this? Oh, it's jewel. Yeah, but this is a sipped up, right? So it has the axe animation as the war. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah, like a war axe, and then it becomes dual wield axes. Um, but this is a scepter item. So where do you get it from if it's... Um, where do you get it from Exiled Lands? And you recently got it. Uh, jumping barrel roll attack knocks attackers to the ground. Watch these guys too, and it's all excited to play a different game. Completely, yeah. So you played it on um, console after watching them play it on PC. Mm-hmm. 
I think they originally uh, farmed support for conservation out to third party. There was definitely a lot of controversy about um, um, about the fact that console didn't get updated. We recently got it back, um, hence the update coming soon. I see. Uh, Casketin, thank you for the follow. Who do who do who likes short shorts? Oh my god, I love short swords. Yeah, brace yourself. Okay, bracing, brace, brace, brace. Short swords are dope. Why do you hate on them? I don't know. I just don't like him. Devilish. I don't know. Most OP agility weapon they have the attack and light spam combo. I just don't like it. I don't like. I don't enjoy it. It's just one of those personal things, isn't it? I just don't like it. Um, I know how to use it now. Like. Um, Oh my god. Kevin, Kevin underscore H underscore 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 Holy contributed shit. 475 pounds and 71 pence towards Gigabyte GeForce RTX. What the fuck? Killed ascent via throne.com. I don't. I don't know what to say. That's a. Don't that's, swear. Never. I swear. Kevin, thank you so freaking much. Holy fucking shit. Holy fucking shit. Sorry if anyone's at work. Good fucking god. That's so much money. Fudging fudgesicles. Yeah, exactly. Holy shit. Holy fucking shit. <laughs> Holy shit. Sorry if you've got kids around. <laughs> and to Kevin. Goodness me. Holy shit. <laughs> Patrick, bless you. Goodness me. Thank you so much. Everybody who contributed. Holy potatoes. Don't swear. No. I swear. Listen, chat. I don't know any swear words, and I really wish you wouldn't draw my attention to it, because I am quite insecure about it, okay? I was bullied as a child because I just didn't know any swear words, and I'm just incapable of swearing. So please don't draw attention to it. It's my shame. <laughs> Holy shit, Kevin. That's incredible. <laughs> Lies, me! How very dare you. I'm in shock, honestly. Oh no, my YouTube video! <laughs> this is gonna be on YouTube. I'll cut this section out. <laughs> Anna swears! No, never. Anna is swearing more than I do in my movies. <laughs> That's why I like her. She's a good turd wallet. Oh. Listen, I don't know any swear words. I stand by it. Thank you, Nefano. That is insane. It's fully funded. Oh my god. Yeah? Squirrel! Yeah. Crikey. Um, yeah, thank you so much. Um, can I, can I just, so Kel, Anonymous, Anonymous, Creston, Kevin, Kel, Bidu, Grayel, Kevin and Kevin. Thank you everybody so much for the 4070 Ti graphics card. That is like... <sighs> Big, hugely big, hugely. What's it? Thank you very much. Now you have to have <laughs> Thank you very much. I'm super shocked, honestly. 
the past few minutes get broken. <laughs> Kevin was looking for cookies as well. The three minutes of solid bleeps and ended with seeing the last one. Oh, uh, yes, yes. Thank you. Well, well done, people. Congratulate, chat. Give yourselves a round of applause. Holy potatoes, that's like huge. Well done, everybody. Congratulations for being amazing. Thank you so much. Big, big thank you. Can't thank you enough. A bunch of leg ends indeed. Yeah. And confirming that I am incapable of swearing, even in the most shocking of times. I think that's really what the take home message of this is. Definitely. Goodness me. I'm like, I'm... yeah. Yeah. Crazy. Gaslight. <laughs> I never gaslight. I don't even know what that means, Valkyries. Stop it now. Heard nothing. Thank you, Hamster. <coughs> Culture of silence. Yeah. So yeah, I I know that the short. I, how do I continue now? Like, I'll never just talk about the short sword. We'll just talk about the short sword. Um. Yeah. I realise it does damage and stuff. I just I just don't I don't really enjoy it. So I heard no swears, just exultations of joy. Exactly. That's it. Yeah, I just don't like this like jab, jabby, jabby, jab situation. So we love the Anna. Oh, I love you guys too. Stop it. Stop it. Oh my goodness. I'm oh my goodness. Well, I guess Ark is back on the freaking table as well, my friends. What do I mean? Did they slow down the sub did they did they slow it down? Is it a bit slower? I don't know. Oh Christ. Christ on a bike. Um let's let's get out of here. Right, we need to leave behind. Okay, katanas don't go in here. Um let's leave the katana in here. Let's just leave um I do have a one handed sword on me actually. Which does loads of damage. Um shall I leave the bow behind? Kevin, do you wanna pick a dungeon? Shall I do a dungeon? Pick a dungeon. And I'll do one if you want. Or pick pick something for me to do in game. Give it to us. And I will do it. Whatever you want. Name something and I'll do it in game. That's like absurd of support. Oh my goodness. Otters with faces. Otters with faces, yeah. Don't think they slowed it down. YouTube's gonna cut to a screen that says ten minutes of not Anna saying curse words and then skip all this. Yeah. Just like a big section and like a red section demonetized. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, Kevin, if you're still here, if you want me to do any something in game, pick a dungeon or something, I will do it. If you want me to fight the arena champion or something like that. Whatever you want. Happy to go with whatever you No, I I mean it though. Like honestly, I feel like let me do something. Seriously. Crikey, Charlie. Um, right. You can think. Ever think about it. Sinkhole. Do you want me to climb into it? It climbed down the sinkhole. Yeah. Could do that. Or you want me to fight the, the dragon? What do you want? What about sinkhole? 50,000 swords later. Listen here, Nefanor. I've never sworn in my life. These are facts. Stop making up lies. Spongebob. Spongebob's cut screen. <laughs> I'll wait for you to say something. Please place a bedroom. Okay, climbing down. Okay, we're going to climb into the sinkhole. Okay. Uh, stop following. Um, I do have a bed here. I have like a bed in here. Let me just make sure it's bound and whatnot. Dum, 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 dum. Bound, yeah. Da, 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 da. I haven't done this for years. It's going to be fun. Going to need all the donations to pay off. <laughs> Swear to Okay. Um, shall I do it cloaked so I don't get attacked? I mean, we'll, we'll fight these dogs. So I'm going to do it over there because I feel like that's the last place I climbed down. Okay, this is for Kevin and for everybody who donated for the... Uh, contributed to the freaking graphics card. Thank you for letting me do something. Um, three streams ago, you showed it could be climbed into good for anyone. Know. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I feel so. I did say. I always say it's like a rite of passage. Um, it's been a while, so I'm excited. And I did say I would do it during this series. 
Um, so yeah, this is, seems like a perfect time. Okay, pick your poison, right? Okay, okay, this one's sticking out, I guess we'll go with. I don't know why I want this one, but... It's probably been, like, at least three years since I've climbed down here, people. Do you know what I'm saying? Mayhaps. Okay, here we go. Dun, dun, dun. We need some, like, silly music for this. Don't we? Oh, God. <laughs> sweaty palms, sweaty palms. Uh, okay, okay. So if we drop down here... God. Okay, I did it, 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 I did it. That was a war cry, by the way. Oh. Um, okay, this is the wrong place. We need somewhere to... Can I see the thing? Yes. Okay, I've got to, I've got to drop here. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Drop here, shimmy along, right? How do I... How do I... Oh no. Okay, okay, that works, that works, that works, that works, that works. It's messy, it's messy, it's messy. It's messy. It's messy, but we did it. It's messy, I'm calling it victory. Do you want me to kill the dragon while I'm here? Let's do it. Be rude not to. There we go. Sweet. Let's fight a dragon. That's it. Never see, never seen it done. Any landing, you walk away, right? Yeah, exactly. Came over the edge of the sinkhole, my own dead body is the right passage because I've done that a ton of times. That's it. Mean it inbound, yeah. Benny Hill soundtrack lined up. Oh, stretch. Thank you, Kel. Oh God, creaking sounds as I stretch. Ugh. Okay, right. <clears throat> so I have steel feud, so this guy shouldn't be too much problem for us. Squeaky, my cat came to investigate because I squealed. Squeakerfin. Hi, little fluff. Hi, baby. Right. All right, sir or madam. Okay. This is for Kevin. Sure, squeaky. Your call is important to us. Squeakerfin. Are you all right? You have a bowl full of food, my love. Ready? Did I get hit? Did I take any damage? And I won't do it again. Just you just do a spawn dive over the edge. Compassionate cat. She's very sweet, honestly. If any photos of your cat want to see the dog? Yeah, look in the Discord in the pet channel. There's a picture of her in there. There you go. Thank you very, 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 very much, people. I'm like super, super grateful. Thank you, thank you, thank you. No damage here. Pro game we're okay, that's it. Yes. I'm very well versed in the dragon fighting. Right, to get out, we will become an angel. Ah, and lo, did she fly as if an angel had, I don't know, done a shat on her head. No. Excellent. Well, everybody. Squeaky, what is it, love? You have a bowl of food. Thank you. Thank you very much. Well timed. Pets and animals. Yeah. Pretty sure Kitty is the Kitty channel. That's it. Well versed in swearing. Excuse you. These lies are un un unacceptable, people. Okay. Uh, let's get rid of this shenanigans. Okay. So let's gather our friendos back. 
I'm kind of pleased that I survived that, honestly. I was like, oh, what's going to happen? Uh, right. Should we go to an NPC camp and see if we can find ourselves some good friendos? Uh, we'll leave the Star of the Champion in my treasure box. Um, over here. Treasure, treasure, treasure. Holy potatoes. I'm still in shock, honestly. Okay, let's go, peeps. Have you got anything on you, sir? Okay, I'm just going to drop that crap. Okay, I'm going to drop everything I don't actually really need. I'll keep the lotus thingies. She's fine. Um, I'll keep, I want to keep that. I don't need a star metal sickle. I've already got my aloe leaves. Let's put these in here. I do have a toolbox because I'm like organized and stuff. I don't need like all those arrows because I... There we go. Crimson lotus and stuff. Um, am I still in creative? No. I was going to fly because I'm lazy. Why run in your house when you can just fly? Uh, Crimson Lotus can go in here. And then let me get rid of my scrolls I don't need. Um, sorcery scrolls. Crikey, people. So how many... It's like one if you've if you've ever climbed down into the sinkhole the way I just did. Type two, if you haven't done it intentionally, but you have fallen in. Type three, <laughs> if you didn't know that was possible. <laughs> One, <laughs> two, 42 is not an answer, nor is 41. Thank you very much. Um, two, one and two, yes. Made my heart swell up and want to cry with how awesome you They're so sweet, Lily. Everyone's so lovely. I use an elevator. Okay, four is the elevator. Four, didn't even know it was even a thing, yes. F fell off an elevator, tried but died. Yeah, I have. I, so I used to do it because I before I didn't know that you could actually. I didn't know there was a legitimate entrance, um, which is down there and like around the other side. There's like a doorway and stuff. Um, but quite often there'll be a lift there. Um, right, where are we going to go first for crafters, peeps? Uh, I guess we'll go summoning place because it's nearby. Let me give her a weapon. Um, um, what's it called? A truncheon because she's she's just going to murder everything. Steel truncheon. Uh, you can have the regular truncheon because we'll get another one from Seth. I like to hit things hard. Let's go, people. Come on, knight. Dun, 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 dun. Fell off an elevator. Every server I've been on, someone built an elevator. Yeah, there's a lot of elevators, definitely. Tried and died. Retried and died. Redied. Yes. Excellent. It's a rite of passage, people. you got to give it a go. One for grey lotus powder. Never, never died, really. Well done. Uh, remember climbing down, it was a sweaty trek. My stamina was so low all the wrong times. Yes. Crikey. Okay. Will we get a shield right today, I am asking. What What did Anna do? Oh, I climbed down into the sinkhole, basically. Instead of uh, going through the entrance, um, because this wonderful community just got me a new graphics card including a very huge donation from one person. So I was like, what shall I do? Let me like, let, what, pick something for me to do in game. Kevin picked climb into the sinkhole. So we did it. I haven't done it in years, but uh, thank goodness. Thank <laughs> goodness I did it successfully. Um, stainless, thank you for the prime. Welcome back, thank you for two months using a prime here. If anyone here wants to join our Discord, by the way, if you want to join this lovely community, you can find us on Discord, there's a link in the chat. Uh, you can join our Conan Exiles server if you'd like to join that as well. Just go to the pinned, uh, look at the pinned messages in the Conan Exiles channel. You'll see joining instructions there if you'd like to join. But it's modded the same as this game, just quality of life mods, plus Pippi, uh, which I don't currently have. I'm not cloaked, am I? Nope. I'm just killing them too quickly. I am going to have to cut out this section because my 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 video is going to get demonetized because of that tirade of like yes and sorry if anyone's at work 
apologize. What are you, buddy? An, an armorer tier one. <clears throat> what are you, bud? You're a York priest, okay. This is why Delincia has yeah. That's right, people. Holy potatoes. Tirade of excitement. Yes, exactly. Thank you for clarifying there. Yes. Bullying the poor level one Dafaris. I know. I'm an evil bully. I know. It's what's nice about this game. You get to do all sorts of ridiculous things you would never do in real life. Hello, brute. Ba -dum, bum, bum, bum. Crikey, people. How many times today will I say crikey? I wonder. Struth. Struth, mate. That's it. Right, let's go check out... Um, I guess we'll check out Sinner's Refuge. Um... next because it's nearby <laughs> sorry <laughs> crikey chief danger mouse danger mouse danger mouse that's such a good show um do the crazy things that you never do in real life is one of the things that make gaming fun exactly it's like it's like GTA San Andreas or something, right? Or Vice City or something, you know. You're not going to go around mowing people down. Don't do that. But in the game, it's hilarious. You know, just randomly punching people in the street. It's freaking hilarious in a game, in a video game. Yes. There's, there is no blood mods. There's there's no blood mods. In, is it? On Steam page. You can have one with no... You can make it so there's no blood in the game. Can you? I did wonder about that, actually. That's half the fun. Yes. Yeah, there's like, there's lots of things in this game that I just, you know, I would never like, would never be acceptable in life. But it's like I play Overwatch. That's a very cute, colourful, fun little game where you just go around and murder people and like, a, you know, it's, it's like, it's good fun. I mean, I play a healer, to be fair, because I'm just such a good person. <laughs> It's really because nobody wanted to go healer back when I started playing and then I'm like, all right, I guess I'm a healer now. So she still has her trench in. So let's see if we can find somebody in here. Got my little short sword. Short swords are quite useful because they're precise. Um, and my hammer is just a bit too, like, AoE wallopy. Um, this is where Gerbeck... Gerbeck later. Ger... Legbiter spawns. And I used to uh, come here to find him. Um, because I wanted to make the Hyperborean Slaver armor back in the day. So I quite, I like the short sword for like just hitting people once. You know when people just go down in one hit, then it's kind of cool. Um, but otherwise I just, I just don't enjoy the animation. It's just a personal thing really. I bet. It's a great place to get brimstone early in the game. Like it's, you know, there's a lot of people here, but... They're all right. Tier two smelter. Dancers. I've got two for one then. A twofer. Okay, we've got a fighter. The guy. Okay, alchemist. Um, Do I need an alchemist? I think I have a witch doctor. I think I actually need another alchemist. So I think we might take him. Do we have a do we have two alchemists? I don't think I have an alchemist on both of my things. So let's take this guy. Congratulations, sir. You have been recruited. It was really our convincing uh, you know, recruitment pattern that convinced him. You know what I mean? Um If you load up on Sinus Refuge Thor's base looks like a cult. It does, yeah, it's true. Uh I am thinking of the follow. Put the lotion in the basket or you get the hose again. Yeah, that's such a scary, uh, scary film. Uh, skin a dead player and give them a rug without telling it's their skin. Horse takes great joy in running over NPCs, yes. Uh, Devon Blair, thank you for the follow. So I always found those idiotic fluff pieces in these of violent video games. Yeah, it's so hilarious, exactly. Let people have fun and they'll maybe be a bit nicer to each other. It's my experience, you know what I mean? 
Um, dun, 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 dun. We have to explain it. Yeah, from, um, what is it called? Silence of the Lambs. Yes, it's a very scary, disturbing film. But it, it is the source of great memes, I suppose. Yeah. Very disturbing, actually. I think I tried to watch it again um, a couple of years ago, and I was like, do you know what? I don't think I want to watch this. It's just a bit, it's a bit much on the day. I don't know if we're going to do that for movie night, people. Oh, yeah, she's got spare food here. Me, oh, we're good. Right, so we got a... We got an alchemist. Cool. Um, let's go. Where should we go next, peeps? Should we go to the galleon? And then I guess we could do Buccaneer Bay. Let's just like do a tour of all the NPC camps. Worlds need and want are completely interchangeable. Mm -hmm. The words need and want. Hmm. Yeah. Fair. Uh, sometimes I need a cookie. Do you know what I mean? So it's a long time ago. Don't remember that. Yeah. 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 It's a creepy scene with like a basket and a, you know. A mean person. Cannibalism. Who wouldn't in extreme circumstances? I have had this conversation like with my parents. I was like, if I if we're ever in like a plane crash, I if I die, like eat like seriously. I'm happy to be a steak. It's fine. I don't care. Cookie cookies are preferred. Yes, of course. That's right. Yeah, I mean not like you know within the first hour. Maybe wait a bit just to see if you get rescued. But you know. Do whatever you got to do to survive. That's where the line comes from. Yeah, exactly. That's where the line comes from. That's it. The silent screen is just recycling. I am in the ground. This has happened a few times when I've been knocked over. Dum 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 dum. Dum 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 dum. Da, 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 da. <laughs> okay, how long before we defeat this creature now? Uh, did I not bring any water again? Chat, who is the one responsible for reminding me to bring water? <laughs> Somebody has to take responsibility for that. Big Spooder, absolutely. That's it. Um, local takeaway. <laughs> How extreme is it? Yeah. So if the local takeaway is closed for an hour, that's not long enough, right? The local takeaway is closed for the whole weekend, right? And the only thing you've got in is like some crackers, maybe some like instant noodles, and you don't feel like eating instant noodles. That's okay. Yeah, but if the if the takeaway is just closed for like an hour because they had to nip out and get some tea bags, I'm gonna say that's a bit, you know, that's a bit too soon. What do I need to fight the giant king? Uh, it, is it the Barrow King? Are we talking about the giant kings? There are people in the Warmaker, the mini bosses of giant kings, aren't they? I think you're probably talking about the Barrow King, right? Um, who is up here? Uh, we haven't fought him yet, actually. He's like over here. Ish. This area. Um, I do have a video on my YouTube channel of me fighting him. If you're trying to um, complete the game free yourself, I'd have a video about that as well called I'm Leaving, which shows you all the pieces you need. Um, if you need to get in, you need demon blood in your inventory. If that's what you're asking. <clears throat> hydrate. Oh, thank you. Literally. Did I drink because you put hydrate? Let me drink. hydrate again. Oh gosh, you've excited Nefinor. Two cannibals. Two cannibals eating a body. One starts at the head, the other at the feet. One shouts, how you doing? The other says, oh my god. That's... <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Okay, all right, people. <laughs> Let's get our skeleton key. Okay. Um, right, Spudo deceased. Let's go to the galleon. We could check this camp here because they have uh, they have a bearer spawn. Hello there. This is kind of a good place to just go. They also have an armor as well. 
Wait, does she have still have her? She still has her trunch. <laughs> totally forgot. Hello, Pablo. Hello, hello. How goes it? Right. Not a named bearer. Not a named dancer. Bum, 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 bum. We've killed like a bunch of named sorcerers in this playthrough. Uh, not a name, Taskmaster. Delincia just does too much damage. She's not allowed a weapon. She just has to scowl at somebody and they'll just fall over. Do you know what I mean? Says me, one-shotting people with my hammer. Hi, lady. All right. So, Sinner's Refuge done. Uh, to the galleon, peeps. Uh, I was considering how quickly I began consuming human flesh, even when there was a readily available supply of wild animals nearby. That's it. It's funny, you know, there's, a, there's an excellent steak restaurant down the road, but I, I just started eating my family. <laughs> um, shall I get some... Shall I get some water from, from the house while we're here? Or I could just yell at chat and tell them it's their fault, because I don't have any. Um, what happened when the cannibal kid didn't finish his dinner? His mother gave him an ear. Okay, what's your worst? Come on, let's let's get the corner jokes out the way. What's your worst dad joke? Worst best. Keep it TOS, people. Um, right, purified water. Let's make some, shall we? Well, I've never seen that before. That writing. So I need some water-filled glass flasks. Where are my alchemy things? I might move the alchemy stuff next to the cooking thing. I don't know. Why don't cannibals like clowns? They taste funny. Oh my god, corner cool, Nefanor. I'm going to flight. I'm going to fight the Barrow King for the first time. You just need like one. Um, you need demon blood in your inventory. You just need it in your inventory, um, and then it'll let you open the door. I have like a video on my YouTube channel showing you the place, what you need, and stuff like that. It's not a difficult fight. You just need demon blood to get through the door. Uh, what was I going to get? Water. Um, didn't I make flasks? Not enough, apparently. <clears throat> Mind is... Yes, don't type it. Um, two guys are in an elevator. One guy farts and everybody knows who did it. Oh yeah, that's fair. That's true. I was like, wait a minute, why? <laughs> oh god. Why didn't the cannibal eat the guy who with no feet? He was lactose intolerant. Oh my god. A physical pain from that one, Nefanor. I remember this scene in Superman where Lex Luthor is played by the genius Gene Hackman. He hustled this old woman out of her fortune on her deathbed. He gets the will signed and leaves the house to take her yacht out to sea. Leaving the house alone, along with her two chihuahua, those small dogs, when he returns, there's only one dog. And his assistant says the great line wasn't there are two dogs. Uh, I don't get it, Kel. What am I missing? Lex Luthor hustled an older woman out the fortune. He gets the will, leaves the house, takes the yacht out, leaving the house alone along with her two dogs. He returns as only one dog. I don't get it. What's big, white, and cannot climb trees? F fridge oh my god real it's so bad <laughs> the shame the shame it's a dog eats dog world as they say oh yo yo one dog ate the other okay okay cool 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 had had a pause on the kel joke to eat. a long pause on the cold yeah i was like what's the joke what's the difference between uh, corner kel definitely um and grayel definitely um, and mutton, if you haven't been sent already. Everybody who's made a joke so far, really bad, awful, shame on you, to the corner. What is the difference between Spanish language and dad jokes? Roll your R's, oh God, in the Spanish language and you roll your eyes. Oh, with dad jokes, okay, yeah. Terrible joke, rogue. To the corner, off you go. Nefer, get the cookies ready. I mean, there's no cookies, there's no cookies. Finger guns, oh my God. What's a British cannibal's favorite meal? Fish and chaps. Oh God. 
You bring shame upon this community. You bring shame. Ugh. Okay, right. Let's fill some water orbs, make ourselves some water, drink away our problems. Do you know what I mean? To the to the poor corner, there's no cookies there. Ah, uh, Nefano's always got that oven going. Oh. Okay, this will do. Let's make some purified water. Bum, 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 bum. Do, 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 do. Honestly, it would have been just as quick for me to go on that side. What am I doing? What am I doing? I do this every time. I'm like not looking. God. Wait, wait, wait. I am going to the cook thing. Oh my God. Chat. Listen, in my defense, okay, it's been a hell of a day already. <laughs> Kel would just with the cookies. <coughs> Excuse me. Right, let's put these on to make some water. Press play. Uh, BRB chat. Just going to nip to the bathroom. BRB. Okay, I am back. Let's go, people. Dun, da, 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 dun. Crikey, crikey, crikey. Okay, let's grab our water. I don't need all of this. Let's just take, like, 20. Uh, 10. 10 will do, right? Okay, perfect. She's good. She can have her weapon back. Do you have anything on you, sir? Ah, you have an alchemist in your pocket. Um, let's put him on the alchemy thing. Uh, this way. <laughs> I need, like, signs saying alchemy this way, don't I? Here we go, put him here. Do 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 do. Dun, 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 dun. Hey, are, buddy. Don't say I never give you nothing. Um, <clears throat> is she still buffed? Yeah, she's still buffed. Beautiful. Let's give her food. All right. Um, NPC come next. To okay, that's the spider. Um. That means this way. 
My house is too big, people. It's too big. Sinkhole. No, summoning. Oh, God. Should we drink some of the water? There we go. To the... To the galleon. Let's go. Don't forget the water. I have the water. I have the water. I have the water. We'll also pick some up from the, the pirates as well. Face of a merch... Oh, that's my merch... <laughs> Dinner a cannibal kid oh god. A dinner at dinner a cannibal kid told his mum he didn't like his grandfather. She told him to try the potatoes instead. <laughs> Famous explorer and his smaller assistant visited a tribe of cannibals. What do the tribe call the assistant dessert? Okay. Uh what do you call a war between two cannibal tribes? A food fight. Oh god. Oh dear. To be fair, Annie did put out the challenge. Sometimes we unfortunately Get exactly what we asked for. I know, I know. It's a love-hate relationship with these jokes, honestly. They had always been there hidden in plain sight. Oh, God. Uh, Shams Sayang, thank you for the follow. Confess you like running around your house, I know. Kel was just admin in the cookies, probably. My dad says it was too into astronomy. I said, what planet are you from? Oh, God. I would, I, I, my dad said I was into astronomy. I said, what? Planet are you from? Oh my god. Corner, if you haven't been turned to the corner yet, to the corner. Uh, let's go. Need a well. We've got the we've got the um there's a river just down there. And uh we have uh we have the ability to make purified water. Usually I put fountains actually in my house. Yes. Back in the day I would have had like large uh, wells with improved fish traps in them. Back when that was fun. Someone get Someone get Brian. Do, 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 do. Right, let's see if we can get um, some good crafters, peeps. Da, da, dum, da, 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 da. Do, 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 do. Dun, da, 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 da. I didn't bring any ice if I'm going to go to the volcano as well. If we're going to do, like, all the NPC camps. Any more cannibal jokes? We'll need a five to <laughs> bounce it with them. Like fish traps in the world they don't work anymore no i'm very sad about that i was i was i really enjoyed it i mean i don't know what's well yeah even if so how do i say this i get why they didn't want us to have the full stack of like all buffs at the same time apologies sir for interrupting your nap um yeah but i would like it if the fish traps could still go in the well I, I remember finding that out on single player when I very first played the game and I was like, whoa, this works. This is cool. Um, but yeah, I kind of wish that was still a thing because it was just so fun. Restream from YouTube isn't here. We're testing again. Ah, isn't it? Hmm. I don't know why, because I have my combined chat. Um, I see it combined in my second thingy. I suppose you'd take it too. So, sorry if I'm missing messages from YouTube. YouTube is the real cookie corner. Yeah, so I can see them because I have, um, do I, maybe I just, instead of reading Twitch chat, I just have to read this combined chat. <clears throat> uh, it is weird. Hmm. Um, Restream bot is VIP, doesn't it? So it shouldn't be. Um... Uh, what is it called? Is it Restream slash user? Someone wants to become a royal baron. I don't know. Um, yeah, I don't know, Kel. I'll just make sure I read to. I'll. I, so in Twitch, we won't be able to see it, but I have a. I do have a combined chat thing. I can see. I can only find butt spot when searching bot. Hmm. Um. Hello, Albion. Sorry to begin by saying I've been in exile in the shadows on your stream. So when you stream, I do try and watch. You're so wonderful. Are you explaining? 
how much knowledge she holds in this game. So much teaching someone who's played this game for quite a while. Thank you so much. That's such a sweet thing to say. Welcome in, Albion. I appreciate that so much. Um, how you stream? Thank you very much for that, Albion. How you stream on YouTube and Twitch at the same time? There's a there's a, a thing called Restream.io, which allows which basically I send my stream, I encode my stream from OBS, um, and it just goes to Restream, and that sends it out to both Twitch and to YouTube simultaneously without taking more bandwidth. A chicken walks into a library and says book. The librarian looks down at the chicken and says, Oh, oh my God. you want a book, huh? <laughs> the chicken responds, book. So the librarian says, all right, here you go, and hands the chicken a book. The next day, <laughs> the chicken comes back and squawks, book, book. The librarian says, oh, you want two books today. And the chicken replies, book, book. <laughs> That's going to get truncated. Was that truncated or was that the full thing? Uh, yeah, it was truncated, yes. Oh, no, it shows us the whole thing. You want two books, so you can book, book. I think it read the whole thing. It just truncates it in the uh, in the chat. Mutton, that was you. Thank you for that. Thank you, Deckard. <clears throat> Thank you, sir. So that watching Anna like, is like being deep, uh, nose deep in a good book. Yeah, that's very sweet. Appreciate that, people. I'm just glad you enjoy yourselves. Thanks for being here and stuff. Is it? Is there a second part? Yeah. So it will. It will cut it off eventually, so that there's not like six million like years of speech. Oh, let me give you your truncheon back before you modify somebody useful, Delincia. Yeah, lady. You're a bit too dangerous for your own good, aren't you? True, yes. Twitch recently changed their streaming rights to streamers. Can... Yes, they've changed the rules. Yep. With it as in like within the last like three weeks. The very first day that I was allowed to multi stream, I was multi streaming. And yes. As soon as because I had I was obsessed with the fact that I couldn't do it. It was like such a great source of like sadness for me that I couldn't so I'm very glad to be able to restream to both platforms yep she's just like she's just tickling them and they're falling over so on a server I've got to modify these people for them to respawn as better versions of themselves you know I mean da -da 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 -da. Uh, I was watching other streams yesterday. I uh, hated every minute of it. Really? Well, I'm very glad you don't hate this place. It's good to have you. I shall take that as a compliment. I can see Twitch chat and YouTube are not seeing. Yeah, Kel noticed that. Yeah, as well. Um, I don't know what's going on. I assume it'll be fine tomorrow. I do have like a combined chat thing on my um, other monitor. So I can just monitor that. But it is strange and unfortunate that... Um, because the whole point is that everybody can see everything everybody says. So it's a bit more of a kind of cosy community situation. <laughs> she just like... How did she even get over there? Did she leap? Did she jump over to those people? What is this woman? Madam, what were you? Tanner. Okay. Sweet. All right, let's keep looking around. Dun, 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 dun. to stop hiding the cupboard <laughs> from the rest of us dun, dun, dun. Do, 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 do. Dun, 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 dun. bum 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 dun, 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 dun. i'm very excited for arc with like actual you know decent settings very excited people um, the cocaine lost the script for a second part. Ah, oh, he's a busy man. Do you know what I mean? Doesn't have all day to be like reading your message out and stuff. Got things to do. Dun, 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 dun. It's another armorer. It does get quite laggy here. I must say. Dun, dun, dun. It's all the the days. If I if I skinned all these bodies, it would be quite so bad. 
Da -da -da -da. Do -do 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 -do. Just like swinging the old hammer around without really looking now. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Da -da -da. All right, people. Did we get all the things? Have I got any? But I haven't got a single bearer pack, peeps. Not a single one. I haven't been collecting them. Should have two. Let's go get the bearer packs, people. Come on now. Might get a bit of alchemical base. I don't even know what they were. Who is the reason for this distractification, I wonder? <laughs> um, why elevated good jokes so good they work on many levels? <laughs> Do you want to see me cry? The YouTube chat restream thing is a problem for us. A couple of days, really? Ah, I see, okay. I see, I see. I'm sure it'll get fixed. Yes. So I don't know. Maybe... So Twitch did want did did want us to not combine chats, but they but I did see some stuff from Dan Clancy, who's the CEO, and basically they just don't want it on the screen, and they uh, the concern is really about anything that's like TOS from other channel other uh, websites making it into Twitch chat. So I don't I don't think they will have like fiddled around to ban like restream bot, because I you know. Um, I think it'll just be some kind of bug situation. They will have been a lot busier recently since we've been allowed to multi-stream um, than they had been before. So I'm assuming that's all it is. Do you use Age of Calamitous? No. Nope. Mm -mm. This is just quality of life mods. This is vanilla, um, vanilla Minecraft, I nearly said. Chat, this is a Minecraft mod. <laughs> it's the greatest dad joke of all time. The grand dad joke. Oh, Valentin, if you weren't already in the corner, make your way over there, please. New arc worth buying. I've, heard, I've played a ton of arc, but I'm ha having a hard time buying a new pretty arc. Well, that's it. So it is a new, it is just a prettier version. Um, hello, madam. I'm sorry to have to kill you, but I just can't be bothered getting my we other weapon out. Could you stop it? Um, yeah, it just looks better, but um, there are some things different, aren't there? There are some other things different. I think the thing is, it just means that it's supportable for more years, which is really why I want this game to have an Unreal Engine 5 update as well. Because then it's like, it's just, you know, get rid of their spaghetti code. Ooh, tier 3. This is a good person to get because we can get some alchemical base from their inventory. Because she happened to survive, I'm very tempted just to, like, befriend her. I don't have a wheel here. So I'll just take a pack. Thanks, lady. Appreciate you. Could have been friends, but it just wasn't on the cards. Thought this was a is this a Skyrim mod, yes. It's an it's an Ark Minecraft Skyrim. What else did we say? Valheim mod. Yes. All of the things. Minecraft, yes. I play Minecraft off stream, by the way. Recently. Should probably bid you all farewell. I foolishly volunteered myself for some slave labour at my mother's house today. Thank you for the entertainment. Hope the new video card treats you all. Uh, me too. Thanks for hanging out, uh, Sir Devilish. Hope you have a good time. Um, hope the work isn't too backbreaking. You know. Did you know Santa knows karate? He has a black belt. Corner biscuit. In my opinion, New York isn't worth it for now. At least pay more money for the same, uh, same game and less content, better graphics. So I think if you have. Um, a good card. The game looks fantastic. I was watching somebody last night and they have like an amazing system and it looks incredible. Like, incredible. Um, you know, I think if you, I think unfortunately, if you don't have like a really good card or a good system or whatever, um, and buying an upgraded version of it, it just doesn't look that much that, that different. Um, you know, and it's in early access, obviously, because, um, you know, reasons, I guess. Let's grab this scroll. Uh, Zuka-san, thank you for the tier one sub. Thank you very much. Welcome in. If anyone here isn't in the Discord and like to join the Discord, you'd have to be a sub. I just like to mention when someone subs, resubs, or gifts, or whatever I remember. <laughs> There's a link in the chat. There you go. Come join us. Come and join the community server if you'd like to. It's an Exile Land server. PvE friendly. Modded the same as this game. Dum, 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 dum. Sweet. Well, no good crafters yet. We did get a named alchemist. 
Um, hello, sir. Let's go. We'll go to the den. Bum, 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 bum. Do, 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 do you think an engine five is it possible now with fun commas it would jump this game another level of play do you think it would be possible I, I definitely think it's possible they would just have to have somebody who makes the decisions would have to think it was worth the investment to take people off this like version of the game that's it so somebody needs to be like we need to do this because this this game will make us money the in future looked at the books and croaked read it oh my god that was awful who is responsible for this come forward please name yourself ah mutton sourdough the very man shame on you to the corner sir Thank you for that. Yeah, I really do hope for an Unreal Engine 5 upgrade because I want I want this game for like many more years to come because I love it so much. Definitely. I know the joke now. Oh God. Oh dear. Let's open our parcels. Off to the den peeps. Let's fight some bosses on the way, shall we? Skip the whole. Oh, it skipped the second part, and it was a long delay. Did it? I thought it was a very short joke. I have to say, I don't like to judge. You know what I mean? Bum 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 bum. It, how? It, it's weird that it skipped the second part. Did it have anything like questionable in it that maybe it like auto modded or something? No biggie. Ah, it was still funny in a like a great groany kind of way so it had the right effect did you hear that she called she called you short just dad don't call oh, i see yeah gotcha can't just stop being a troublemaker please from the corner it's strange you can communicate from the corner the brewery was curious about this chicken so followed him followed him with the books she saw the chicken taking books to a frog and showing him to the frog and the frog said reddit oh i see weird Weird that it missed it out. Sorry, I'm like extra singy today. Dum 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 dum. <laughs> I feel like doing something crazy, like fighting the arena champion with some weird weapon or something. What would be the worst weapon to fight the arena champion with, peeps? If you had to, if you had to fight the arena champion, what would be the worst thing you could think of to use? I hate that tiger. I used to hate it. It used to really scare me. But now, um, could be nearly dead. Oh gosh, is he gonna kill me? No, of course not. I am a pro gamer. I do have steel feud, so I don't have to worry quite so much. Anyway, it's practice. I was thinking about the practice sword. Yes, stone club kicking, kicking. Arcane staff, the battle spatula, truncheon, a truncheon. Stone Club. Um, and it's extra singy. She will soon have 470 I rendering her steps. I know, yes. I'm very, very, very grateful, honestly. Incredibly happy. Fists kicking. Hmm. Dun -dun. The ore? The ore? What is the ore? Da -dun. Da -da -dun. He did declare Nefanor Master of. Dad corner jokes. Aww. I think Nefanor is unofficially the master of the worst jokes in the whole community. I mean, gonna have to menu spawn in, but a handsaw? A handsaw? Oh my goodness. But, um, should we have a poll? The ore? The ore? I'd have to respec. Isn't that, is that a strength weapon? <laughs> Does it matter? 
Do we have a mod who can do a poll for like the worst joke? Uh, not the worst joke, sorry. I don't know why I thought that when I saw Nephilim's name. Uh, the worst weapon, and I'll fight the arena champion with it. A severed arm! I was thinking about fighting a naked with the worst weapon. Just because you guys have done so much for me today. The librarian of libraries, Tarek puns, yes, Nefanor. And so you shall be crowned. The turdiest of all the wallets. Severed severed arm would be great. Okay. If we can have a poll. If we've got Kalendros, can you if you're not drunk. I don't know why I would say that. It is a Friday. <laughs> And you got your credit card out today, so um, yeah. If you guys vote on a on a weapon, then uh, I will fight the arena champion naked with it. No armor, just one woman and a terrible weapon. At least we can give Anna a leg up in the fight. Have a leg up, oh my god! Bad, bad jokes. Bad, bad jokes. Dum, da, 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 da. Let's get this turd wallet. Ten minute. Nice, there you go. Ten minute poll. Let's see what he spelt wrong. The or severed arm fists arcade staff kicking. Okay, no, kicking is not an option. I'm not going to kick her to do <laughs> I'm not going to kick her. Crescent. Crescent's already a sub over here, I believe. Oh, let's give. At least we can give Anna, yes. Kicking. I'm not going to do kicking, people. Come on now. Kicking her. Come on now. Kicking is not a weapon. That's it. That's... That's like weaponless. That's like that's like choosing fists. Hands or Okay, there's a poll at the top of the Twitch chat. Um can you see it, peeps? Have a vote and I will I will fight the arena champion with the weapon. A weapon! Kicking is not a weapon, you lunatics. I wanna give my I wanna actually have a chance to win. I wanna win because I'll enjoy that. Uh, you have heavy boots on. I will. We'll be naked. We'll be naked. Bum, bum, doo -doo -doo. I can spec up and buff myself however I want to, but I won't wear any armor. Um, you got yeah. You got ten minutes to vote anyway. Oh, the baby! Look at him running away. It's like sliding along. Bum, bum, bum. If you're in YouTube and you want to vote in the poll. Pop over to Twitch. Okay. If it's a strength weapon, I'll change to strength uh, points. There we go. I'll take that ebony silk. This, this is, this is Conan. Oh gosh. Let me see what, see who's winning. Um, so, so far the severed arm is winning at 65%, followed by the ore, which is the ore that you can learn from the boat next to, what is it called? Uh, the Dagon dungeon. Did she, she's still using the truncheon. No, yes, yes. <laughs> Listen, I am distracted, okay? And it's chat's fault, right? This is what I'm sticking to here. Onwards. She actually has a weapon now. <laughs> now, when did it took so long to kill that creature? Kicking is a privilege, Anna. D reserves for Carty alone. That's it. Absolutely. That's it. Carty gets my kicks. Do you recall we did this before testing various weapons, Paul? Yeah, but we didn't do any meme weapons, though, Kel. We did like, like, you know, name a weapon and let me try it. But we've never done any like meme weapons, like, you know, silly things. Um, Kifo, thank you for the follow. Yeah, yeah. So we were like, oh, you know, let's try something. Let's see how it, how it does. But yeah, a meme. Dun, 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 dun. The horse, yes. 
obviously doing great stuff here. Okay. Bearer. Not a named one. So I've arrived here now, and now I need to give my cruel uh, truncheon back again so she doesn't modify anything. Can I give you the momentum? That means the horse has got something rotten in their inventory that's hidden. There we go. Yep, yeah, that bit of rotten flesh. Oh god. Brace so, yourselves. The librarian hands the chicken two books and away it goes. The third day, the chicken returned and squawked. Book, book, book. <laughs> By this point, the librarian was curious. And after giving the chicken three books, decided to see why it needed so many books decided to see why it needed so many books oh the librarian followed the chicken to a swamp where the chicken laid out all the books on the ground in front of a frog okay Ooh, is this that legendary acid claws yeah just lying there thank you for that thank you let oh my goodness book book, book. <coughs> did it read the whole thing won't suggest trying to practice sword then, yes. Yes. Yeah, this is these we've had these before. This is a second set of these black claws. Um so cool and agility as well. We've got one at home, um, which I haven't used yet. Because we were waiting for the master weapon fitting. So like punching daggers. They look very cool. But um I do miss the old animation from the what is it? Bestial claws or whatever it was. Um, where you kind of like howled at the moon. Da -da -da. She's just too good. She just knocks him out before I can kill him. Da -da -da. Do -do -do. Dun -dun. Dun -dun. Oh, you're already dead. My apologies. What do we got there? A war axe, an iron war axe. I'll leave that. So far, the severed arm looks to be leading. Okay. Get your votes in, people. Waiting for episode three of Saga of the Chicken and the Library. <laughs> is it a different joke? Is that what it is? Was it a different joke than earlier? Was it just the, the full version of it? Silly people. Silly, silly people. Um, I wonder if the if we can have a boss today. Uh, doesn't look like... Uh, Should have hit him. Sit. There we go. Doesn't look. It looks like the same. It looks bigger than him. No, it's not the boss. The boss is like slightly bigger, and he drops things like doom hammer, um, those claws, bestial claws or whatever, which are like okay. The doom hammer is good, but they also he also drops the more of the hyena. Which was the best cleaver in the game for a while. The ore is a weapon you pick up, or you pick up the recipe from the the boat, which is the entrance to the Dagon dungeon. So it's a kind of a silly weapon. You, I just have to check she's not named. No, just high priest. Oh, there's a lot of lag here. Dum dum. Do do. Do, 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 do. Sweet. Da -da. Do, do, do. Mm -hmm. Um, I was planning to spend the evening playing Konex and somehow got stuck to a woman by the name of Anna Briello. Who might she be? Sounds interesting. 
Ah, bless you. Lucian Zeal can be a good weapon, just layer it onto a great sword. Or of or of Krom. I love that. I mean you can't well, it depends really if it's good or not, doesn't it? I guess if you, you mean if you transmog it. Uh, the appearance so it looks like a crappy weapon and it actually is a sort of crumb yes i see i see well everything can be a great weapon then I suppose i guess you could you could transmog a practice sword has anyone ever done that onto like something really impressive like a f frosty sword or something. Uh, right, we've done the den. How is the pole going? How long have we got left? I can't see how long it's got left. Oh, is it finished? Pole ended. Severed arm. Okay. Let's make our way to the Warmaker dungeon then. And I will solo fight the arena champion with a severed arm. <laughs> Because that's what chat has decided. Let's go. To Sepamaru. Transmog the human leg onto hammer from the war maker, really? I love that. So we could teleport using the werewolf friendo. Uh, but that would take us to the wine cellar. We may as well just go this way. Dum, 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 dum. Oh, gosh, people. I'm still in shock, honestly. Dun 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 So is it a craftable item, the severed leg? No it isn't, it's one that you get from harvesting yourself, right? Yeah, so I can't craft it. That would be weird, to craft a leg out of like bits of other body parts. Alright then. Um... Leg, dead leg is craftable if you get the recipe from the library. Oh yeah, it is. <clears throat> dead butt is craftable if you get the recipe. Is it better then? Um, we might we might already have it actually. Yeah. Crafted at blacksmith bench. Okay, I will craft one with a sh with a bladesmith. Shall I? Yeah, we've got a bladesmith. Have we got a bladesmith? No, we haven't got a bladesmith. Hmm. I'll craft it with a temper, right? Tempersmith? Severed arm or dead leg? Oh, I see, yeah. Which one was it? Was it the severed arm? It was the severed arm, right? Yes. So it's one that I pick up. That's it. So I'm not crafting it. It's just going to be... I'll just spawn it in. Yep. Does it have a durability, though? Do I need more than one severed arm? <laughs> Seemed like a, a series of severed arms on my hotbar. Dum, 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 dum. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. We'll leave Delincia and the horse outside, and I have to gear up now. Crafting an epic helmet for one from someone's someone's butt. We need more than one. Yeah, we need more than one. Yep, yep. Let's leave our friends here. Hey, Delincia. Oh my. Uh, Corestas, thank you for the raid. Welcome in, raiders. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We're about to do some very strange meme-ish things here. Because my community just gifted me a graphics card. Um, incredibly generously. And so I'm doing ridiculous things to, like, you know, show my gratitude. Welcome, raiders. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for bringing people in. So, yes, we're about to fight the arena champion uh, with a severed arm, as voted for by chat. Welcome, people. Oh, hello, hello. Um, Crescent Moon, uh, Calendry. Hello, Carustus. Hello. Welcome, welcome. Sparklebutt. Welcome. Wonderful name. 
Well, but spot behave yourself. We've got guests. It's a raid. It is a raid. Hello, people. Hello, Nupper. Hello, hello. Um, yes, yeah, so we're about to gear up to fight uh, the arena champion now. Um, so, yes. Uh, severed arm. Oh, gosh. Severed arm is this one here. So we'll loot this from our body if we harvest it. What does it do? 11 damage and 24% armor pen. So I'm going to put master weapon fittings on this. You know that, right? Um, I'll tell you what we'll do. We will teleport back and let me gear up at home for this. I'm going to optimize myself for this fight, okay? It's within the rules, okay? It's within the rules. A master weapon arm? Yeah, we're going to put master weapon fitting on a severed arm. Um, yes. Okay, let's do it. Let's let's optimize ourselves for this meme fight. All right. Um, first of all, I'm going to put stuff in these boxes, like I had before. Just get rid of all our serious stuff. And gear up. Can I apply poison to it? What do you think, peeps? Um, we're going to do it naked, as we said. Okay, stop following. I need to place them here, otherwise they'll return back to the war maker. Okay. Um, so, severed arm. Okay, first of all, we'll get our weapons ready. <laughs> what am I doing? Okay, so we're going to have a whole load. We've got 660 hits on each one. Honestly, I don't think we need all of them. So we're definitely going to have, like, heals in two places here. I'm going to use weak aloe like I usually use, because that's what I usually use. Um, there we go, a stack of each. We shouldn't need any of the, anything else. And now we're going to put... <laughs> I'm going to put master weapon fittings on severed arms. I've never tried to do this before. Um, there we go. Master weapon fittings. You learn this from uh, completing the Warmaker dungeon. There you go. What does it do? So without anything, it's 11 damage, 24 armor pen. With it, it's 16 damage, 36% armor pen. Oh, gosh. It's going to take a lot of wallops, isn't it? Okay. Oh, we have just the right amount. Okay. So now I'm currently spec for agility, and this is a strength weapon, right? So we're going to respec any points we have in agility. We're just going to move them into strength. Um, I currently have a max grit, which gives me steel feud. So she has to, I don't need armor. She has to hit me three times before I can die. Okay. And I'll have to add myself admin uh, a point because there's a bug, a bug that means I don't have 60 uh, attribute points here. So we're going to go one in expert. Do I need that one? Maybe we don't use that because I'm not carrying anything. Uh, so stout, increase armor by f a fifth of your stamina. Um, okay. Defensive posture, incoming damage reduced by 15% while you're attacking or blocking. And then steel feud. There we go. Nothing in authority. Um, we're going to go, let me put my points in max strength. Uh, combos deal 20% more damage. There we go. Berserker, well below 50% health, you deal 25% more damage and gain 100 armor. And then um, Crushing Swings, your, your heavy attacks stagger for 25% longer and no longer rebound off. Shields. Okay. And then the rest we're going to put into Vitality. And I'll need to add a, a perk. Faster Healer. Usually I like Resurgence for fighting her. Let me admin in my extra point there we go because of the bug there we go vitality uh, glutton for punishment when you take damage you regenerate the last instance of damage taken over 15 seconds there we go this is our spec for fighting the arena champion with a severed arm yes passes a kick this should be humorous oh my gosh um let me just like make sure i'm healed up for the fight Okay, I also need food and water. I'll just do like a... Uh, oh, I'm going to buff myself as well. Mark my words, friends. Um, so we're going to do black lotus and we'll do salted pork to buff our strength. Um, 
black lotus and then we need to make some salted pork for this salted pork this one here there we go this will buff our strength <laughs> champion eight minutes 20 seconds to kill it oh this is gonna be hilarious oh, yo, yo. um blinked for 10 minutes is a nap okay salted pork and we've got some black lotus as well so this is it, right? I mean, I could try and put like, um, oh, I need water as well. Okay. Okay. So we've got strength buff from food and from, <laughs> and from uh, potion. We've got lots of health, lots of stamina. And we got some arms that we didn't need anymore. Let's get back over there. Okay. You know you can do the champion in a game, so I have faith in you. Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. Okay. Let's go, peeps. Let's do it. Don't forget the water. I know. Da, 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 da. This is the most absurd thing we've ever done. It's going to be great fun. I don't have my keys with me. We'll just ghost. Dun, da, da, da. Da -dum, dum dum Oh yes. Oh yes. And so she flew like an angel to her death. She's flying. <laughs> That's it. Hi lady. Is everybody ready for this? This is for the community who bought me a graphics card today. Just out of the blue. Thank you very much, everybody. Be ready for the memes. I'm just gonna hydrate myself, do you know what I mean, before I get killed. Okay. I'm excited. I'm excited. I have a bit of a headache in game, but otherwise we're fine. Here we go. One lady, six arms, two two lots of heels, and a very dangerous a very dangerous boss. Who will win? Got to warm up. Okay, hold on. I have an itchy eyeball. One sec. Okay, it's gonna take a while. It's basically like using a truncheon, isn't it? I do roll very well because I have no weight. Okay, so I get her attacking. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, let's run. This is where resurgence is nice. There's my glutton for punishment. She runs very fast. See, she's already caught up with me. The problem is this, the, the lead in for the heavy attack. It takes a little while. I'm gonna do like a light attack first. It's right that I'm all bloody with all these arms, isn't it? Is this the most gruesome thing we've done? Yeah, start with a light attack. Definitely. Oh my goodness, I didn't even think she was anywhere near me then. She did seven, 446 damage. Better have steel feud. Ah! 
Yeah, that, that like, it was a war cry chat. I wasn't afraid. The AoE is huge, isn't it? I think one arm is probably enough. God, I see the hit coming. I see the hit coming. I have full respect for this woman, honestly. Okay, a couple of like, maybe two or three light attacks and then a... Yeah, I mean, I could have had po added poison as well. Maybe that would have been like better. That would be kind of funny. Come on, lady. Look at that. Look at that. Like, to my eyeballs, we're not next to each other. Do you know what I'm saying? She's so scary. Could just, like, end with the heavy... Yeah, this, if you do, oh, second attack, if you second hit is heavy, she will hit you again. You gotta do like a couple. Okay. Okay, get her attack in. Best to hit her when she's down. Couple of hits when she's down. Get out of the way. Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. The knockdown is very comfortable, very help, uh, help, help helpful. <laughs> Yeah, that second, like, yeah, yeah. Don't do light, then heavy. Definitely don't do light, then heavy. Do two two light attacks at least, and that will stun her. Nope, 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 nope. Let's have a heal. If you move away and you're healing like that, make sure you spam your ult key. There we go. There we go. There we go. Well done, everybody. Oof. There we go. Screw you, lady. Screw you. This is for my community. Screw you. Screw you. That's right. Yeah. Gotta run. Thank you very much. Thank you, everybody, for joining us. Welcome in on the raid. Thank you, everybody, for sticking around. There you go. That was super fun. So, yeah, we only needed one severed arm for that. And yeah, I mean the champion is down. Let's get out of here. Did you enjoy that, peeps? Oh, I need a key. Let's ghost out. Oh, agility armor. GG. Great one. Thank you very much. Was it four minutes, 50 seconds? Yeah. Putting the master weapon fitting on it, buffing ourselves, um, max strength as well. Doesn't really, I guess it doesn't really matter what you've got. As a weapon does the short sword cheese still work on her i mean anything yeah sure anything can i mean i fight her with daggers usually you can defeat her with stone daggers i've done that a bunch of times um oh it was good fun i like it she's one of my favorite fights in this game can i get rid of these arms i was about to suggest i do some fight somebody else like this but let's not go get too carried away shall we uh where do we live over here oh champ ago it was five from it was five minutes 
14.74. Put that arm in a trophy display. Ah, oh, great fight. Thank you very much. It was good fun. It was good fun. It's always a bit of a thrill. Uh, right, so let's drop anything that isn't ours. I guess we'll keep the Black Lotus. Bum, 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 bum. Um, we'll put the pork in the fridge. Take our usual stuff back. I'll respec back to agility. Uh, yeah, I think we did well with our with our like points there. It worked out pretty well. Uh, back to steel feud. But yeah, she would have like what one shot us if we didn't have steel feud. Um, uh, let me max oh, agility first. Rolling thrust. And then no points authority. And we put everything else in vitality. And then we need to admin ourselves an extra point because it doesn't give it to us. Faster healer. Glutton for punishment was handy as well though, wasn't it? Uh, then uh, point so we can spend it there perfect so now we're respect put our clothes back on i don't know how to make it so it doesn't go down like that i even so somebody said to me you have an item selected at the bottom and that's why when you click on that it goes down to the bottom item but even when i click on something else it still does it do you know what I'm saying? You know, you know what I mean, right? Does this happen to other people? It can't just be me that it bugs. What's the solution, peeps? Let's put a master weapon thing on these black claws so we can enjoy those. Oh, I feel the cold coming coming in. It's minus three outside, apparently. Oh, oh. It's one... Uh, I think it's maybe Anna has played this game before. Maybe. It's a full set of Relic Hunter tools in the bazaar. Oh, yeah, the transmog. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep. Yeah, this bone conjurer set. So, yeah, all this stuff was given to me by Funko. I haven't worn this yet. I haven't used it. Um, I kind of want that gibbet thing. I still haven't got that gibbet. Do you know what I mean? Um, we need to do something with all these things, really. To try out the, the library thing. Do you want me to show you the library thing? Because I haven't tried it out yet. Shall we see if it how good it is? If it's working and stuff. Um, let's put stuff away. Uh, yeah, I want to try out these black claws. Um, right, I'm just, I don't, I don't need this stuff. I'm just going to drop it. I know, I know it's a crime. Do, do, do. Um, so yeah, master weapon fitting on our claws. Which we've got two lots of now. You get my friends back. It would just you driving me out. Yeah, when it scrolls down. Somebody said to me, oh, it's easy to fix. It's because you're clicked on something. But even when I click on something else at the top of the list, it still does that weird scrolly thing. Um, but what do I want? Tinker's Bench. I just used all my master weapon fittings on a bunch of severed arms, which is suboptimal. Um, have I? Oh, wait. I'm always clicking on the blacksmith bench instead, by mistake. Master weapon fitting. It's this one here. I'm just going to make ten of these because we put them on everything. There we go. We'll put that on our claws. So the claws are now 57 damage, 21% armor pen, and they have acid as well. Uh, all right. Let's eat some salted exquisite meat to replace our strength buff. And we'll drink some elixir of grace. Um, do you have those, buddy? Yes, you do. Let me get rid of these from your inventory. Um, give you back your weapon. Rebuff you. Repork you. Let's give you some snacks. Um, okay, so I'm buffed again for my agility. So we're back the way we were. 
I've got, have I got water? <laughs> Shall I get some more waters? Because I'm always running out of water. Um, gotta go, always a good show, stay warm, don't forget what Ah, thank you, lovely. Thanks for hanging out. Um, thanks for everything. As claws, they will eat away armor foes. Yeah. That's some more water. Um... Um, where do I put my goods? Let's just put them in here for now. These can be the dump boxes. Anything else I, can, I don't need to carry? Uh, the horse can take some tools. We don't need to carry around salted pork. Nor do we need 10 of those. All right. Um, where are we going next? I like distractified myself. Um, we went to the Galleon. So I guess we go up north now. We could go to Buccaneer Bay. I reckon up north is a bit more interesting, isn't it? Was I going to do something else? Remind me if I was. Um, don't know if this is a bug, I'm playing an official PvE. The snake eggs are taking well over an hour to respawn. Does anybody have any insight on that? And um, snake eggs respawning? It was not always like that. It wasn't hamster, was it? The the inventory thing. It wasn't. Um, hello, smoke. Hello. Sorry if I've missed anybody coming in. Oh, demo of beating the arena champion. Ah, oh, bless you. Um... Bum, 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 bum. Anna's doing this naked and the seven arm, seven arm of struggling and aging armor and venom daggers. Bless you. Um, strategic. You know what would make this even worse humiliation is if the arena champion. It was the arena champion's own arm. Yes. She's doing well. See, you know, the devs will see this and nerf all the seven body parts. That's so funny. They did nerf the. They did nerf steel food. Need a helping hand in this fight. Oh my god, bad joke corner. It's cold. It is cold fighting, Aya. It's very cold. Um, character hydrate, yes. Ding ding, let the beating begin, yes. Right, all caught up. Why do cannibals like eating pirates? Because they're, they're a buck and ear. Oh my gosh. Right, let's go up north, shall we? And look for some crafters and stuff. Shenanigans. She's got her weapon, right? Yeah, let's go, peeps. Charge! Shall we do my usual my my music playlist, people? Do you want me to just leave the music the sound as it is? What do you think? If anyone who's usually here, it's like appropriate music. It's not like hip hop or like dance music. Both both very good classic categories of music. Shall we? What do you think? Could you not attack me, sir? Am I going to die? Sorry, right, Delincia's on it. There we go. It's like nothing ever happened. I like some music. Yeah, music's good. Yeah. You, can you hear this? Is it okay? Should I have a quick listen? It's my usual volume, I think. One sec, people. I don't know why you can't hear it actually. Ah, it's just too quiet. Okay. Um... Is 
Is that better? Test. That seems good. It'll get louder, so we'll have to monitor it. It does get louder. You can hear it more now. Yeah, that's good. I don't want it to like completely... Okay, we're going the wrong way. Am I going the wrong way? This is my like... I usually play this when I do Valheim. It's like our intro music now as well. Bum, 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 bum. Let's go, peeps. I'm gonna ignore that boss in a bid to get up north. Can hear it without the game. Can hear it without the game going. So it should be fine now. You should be able to hear both. Yeah. Yeah. I don't want it to like. Um, what's the word? Drown me out in the game as well. Oh, fine now. Good, good, good. God, we're all happy. Yeah, it does get a bit louder, so. Bum, 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 bum. Do, 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 do. Right, we'll go to the north. Look around Azagoth and then, like, the northern camps, I guess. See if we can find any be interesting. Da, 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 da. It's good, it's appropriate for Conan as well. I like this music. So we're gonna go through our little, like, the little cut through that we always use to get up north. Which is handy, because it's quite near the savannah. Back in the day, I would always climb up with my friends. It's so funny, you know. Because we would we would come down here and I I just didn't know that you there was this little cut through. So we would eventually we had a lift and we were like, Oh thank god there's a lift now. But we would always climb up. It was kind of funny. Back back on single player slash co op. Here it is. Sounds okay, good, good, good. Dun 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 doo 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 There we go. Where's my little horse? Come on, buddy. Do I have Delincia with me? Yes. Right, she's got her weapon. She's buffed. She doesn't have her food buff anymore. There we go. go. I wonder if we can find somebody today. That'd be kind of nice. Round off the stream. I never knew about this cut through till you showed me. Did you? Ah. Uh, charge. Okay. I missed him. So we haven't been to Leon's watch in this playthrough yet. Dun, 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 dun. Did I put down a wheel at Azagar? I feel like I did. If I didn't, I'm just going to place one. Um, in a kind of, you know, in a way that will enrage somebody. Just one person. Bum, bum. Da, da, da. Do, do. I'm looking forward to more VRAM, people. Honestly. Da, da, da. Do, do. I looked at the 4070 and I looked at the difference with the 4070 Ti and the Ti just gives, will do like the difference in frames that will come out of uh, streaming. You know what I mean? Because I'll lose frames from streaming. Hello, Dina. She's a 100% spawn rate. She's always here. Let's go up the slope, shall we? I want to visit the people at the dam first, maybe. 
Bum, bum. Do, do, do. Mm -hmm. I don't know what today's VOD is going to be like with that, like, ridiculous 10 minutes of, like, you know, unmonetizable language. <laughs> So I don't know what, yeah, I don't know what today's going to be, really. Fortunately, I didn't do anything particularly interesting. Oh, apart from the Arena Champion fight, which is interesting, I guess. I will probably make that into a video. Leon, you love, you love Leon, don't you? That sexy smack-talking bald man, really. That's funny. He's a good, he's a good fighter. ba da -bum. Da -da -da. Right. Now, Delincia is in, like, modify everybody mode. I guess we'll give her a truncheon just in case. Um... I'll get mine out ready. We've got Seth's truncheon for us. Um, I'll keep my... I'll keep her momentum on me just in case we need that. Let's use these, what, these daggers, shall we? We just got... There we go. Gotta get used to them. Dun, dun. Do, 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 do. So we got a cook? Question mark. Tier 3 cook. Tier 2 archer. It's kind of cool. Let's do the living first. Does anyone use punching daggers? This is, what's your favourite type of weapon, peeps? What are you What are you using? It's an entertainer. You do strength or agility. What are you What are you using? Oh, you're more of a builder than a fighter. Champion section needs clipping. Yeah, yeah. I will I will I will put that in the I'll edit that. Um Taskmaster and an armorer. She just like looks at him, wallops him, and he falls to the ground. Dum dum do 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 I would love something that we could put on to make us swim faster. It'd be kind of cool. Agility and short sword plus daggers. I love daggers in this game, definitely. I always use daggers a lot in the beginning of the game because it just continues to be such a great tool, really, doesn't it? Daggers. I like axe or daggers. Yeah. I used to really love the war axe. I really want an agility war axe. I would love that. Yeah, still play strength war axe. It's like Skyrim, self archery for me, I have to do it. Ah, great sword, knives and bow, 15 strength and agility, really? Do you do, so, um, if you do S, if you use a strength build, A, if you do agility build. You can put S, A, I suppose, if you, like, do both. I'm interested. I'm, like, all about agility now, and I don't like to mix it, mix it up. I want to just have as many points in, like, agility as possible. Back when I was doing strength, I would have all of it in strength. Agility and strength. Agility. Um, unofficial, I respect to agility and playing with katana, loving agility. Mm. I did enjoy the katana for a while on like maybe chapter one playthrough, I feel like. But then I think once I got higher level, I think I maybe switched to Baltier's Razor. Some people claim to be able to beat someone with one hand tied behind the back. Anna did it with five arms tied to her back. I think there were six actually, no, but yes. Okay. There's always traditionally a dagger war axe, but I'm starting to get to the katana. Hmm. Nice one, butt spot. Traditionally a butt. I was a butt butt slash war axe, starting to butt into the katana. Nice, yeah. Agility strength, the initials. Yes. Yes. Uh, agility, daggers, and katana. Nice. I just love, like, um, yeeting around. So, these daggers are fine, but I don't... the. I don't like the punching daggers animation as much as, like, just regular daggers. Even though you can probably stun 
quite well. Probably decent against the arena champion as well, actually. Dun, 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 dun. I would always be like um, max strength um, and then I guess th like three perks in vitality um, and then maybe about the same in grit in the old days before they changed the perks. Um, I would always have the first perk in agility which enabled you to run, uh, not use as much stamina or strength splinting, whatever it was. Um, that's how I used to spec. Bum, bum, bum. Uh, there's no books here, are there? Sit. Okay. Sit emote. Um, stuff in this little thing here. Nothing here. Okay. Don't generally don't put points in either. Um which container is good for storage? The vault can contain the most, surely, but it's so big and, well, ugly. Uh, the vault is, like, the biggest single, like, storage item. Uh, what is it called? The arcane thing, Kel? That was really good. It did get nerfed, though. Um, what was it called? Is it in furniture? This is what I used on Sipta. There it is. Arcane Curio Cabinet. That's what I used on Sipta. Is it bigger, people? How many spaces does it have? I like these because they, they, I think they were bigger than chests, question mark. Do, 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 do. I can hear howling or something in the background. Can I? Um, let's go check on, let's go check on Leon. He's down here, isn't he? I haven't been to see him yet. Wasn't that bizarre only? I think it was either bizarre or it was battle pass. Mm hmm. Bigger than chess, cannot wait for it to come back in the bazaar. Yeah, and they have a light source as well, which is kind of cool. Really like to find an agility greatsword or hammer. Baltier's razor or blade of the adventurer. Back to Corbin. I guess you know about these. Um, yeah, these are agility weapons. Baltier's razor is my favorite greatsword because with a master weapon fitting, it does 80 and 35. Um, and it weighs 0 0.1 and it has loads of durability i love it so much um and then back to corbin is my like you know most used weapon probably um playing on a server <coughs> excuse me official exiles except they need to play with actually builds need to play with excellent actually builds have never really respect mm. um what do we do my story area? good bet looking could actually start talking a bit better yeah I do really like those cabinets because they, um, just because they look a bit better than the chests, you know. I feel like, um, so what I used to do, tangent, is I, I used to kind of place, um, what are they called? I used to place tables, um, these ones, either these. used to place tables and just put like chests on them one sec I used to put chests on these things these are from the um argosian dlc um and i would line up chests you know i just kind of put them in a pretty way maybe i would use the bigger box but i would like put say one in the middle There we go, the lights are a bit better. I would like line them up, but without kind of changing my settings. I would I had the I was so good at making them like look really straight. Um 
and then I would kind of like arrange them. And I would have these tables around the, the what's it called, around the room, like in a storage room. Um, you can also make shelves with, um, what's it called? I need like a wall. I haven't used this stuff yet. Um, I would put like ceiling pieces. Um, did I have ceiling pieces? I guess I would fill down here and then I would have like um, more boxes up here, I think. I think I have a picture at some point somewhere. Um, but yeah, now that they made it harder to kind of like line up your chests as well. Um, yeah, exit creative. There we go. Yeah, but I like those cabinets now because they are, you can just dot, dot them around and they look like you've decorated. You know what I mean? With like minimal effort. Right, she's still got her steel trench in. So Leon should be yeah, Leon should be a guaranteed spawn here. You can also get what's his name, Janos here too. I don't have any points in the authority. He's ignoring me. But I do have um, concussive damage from my Skellis Cultist armor. As well as uh, follower points. What's it called? Follower damage. And I'm using Seth's truncheon here. So he's out. And Delincio does a lot anyway. Come with me, friend. There we go. Oh, we could do with that smelter as well. Maybe we'll come back for that person. Because this is a server, like on single player, I would have left that person behind. Because they would despawn or whatever. Um, but on the server, they should still be there. So I guess we'll go back for that tier 3 smelter. So you've got another furnace that doesn't have a friend in it. There's some word salads. I've always used craftable weapons. I like to be able to make it... Um, I like to be able to may take a little longer to kill just don't like relying on rng hmm i see yeah well that's fair enough i i think because they increase the durability of the legendaries because i enjoy fighting bosses um i i get replacements uh, soon enough to to use my favorite legendaries all the time so i'm happy um i think if you get a good craftable though like i always used to use those venom infused weapons we're going to put a wheel here, people, because how many times have we ridden home? The brute is still here, exiled in the cold. Uh... There we go. Like it never happened. Leon, welcome to the tribe, my friend. Da -dum, da -dum. Doo -doo -doo -doo. You put that in there. Alright. How are you doing, brute friendo? We could use him if we, <laughs> if we wanted to. Um, right, we're going to keep the truncheon on her. Let's go in and see if we can find anybody good at Azagar. Dum 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 dum. Okay, she coming with me. Bum 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 bum. Oh no. Hello? I got disconnected. That's weird. I thought my stream was uh, crashing then. Let me just log back in. That was weird. Too bad you're not on our server, you could have picked up the brute. You could have just... Oh, picked up the brute. I see, yes. I could turn that function on. How is that going? Are you enjoying that? I don't know why it just kicked me out. Steam. Uh, when able to, killing world boss is great for thrall XP leveling. It's got to use go to dungeons. I went to my region just a few minutes ago. I see. Is a pure aloe good or not? 
Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. So one of the aloes is like very expensive to craft. One of them is just like leaves and one alchemical base. Um, wait, I've got to do my... Oh, wait, you can't see it anyway. That's fine. Um... Oh, wait. Hold on. I've got like copied and pasted something into my password thing. One moment of friends. Yeah, I don't know why it kicked me. I guess, I guess Steam. As long as I'm able to get back in. Okay. All right, we're back. Um, I've lost my buffs because of that. Let's re-eat them. Where's my elixir of grace? Um, what was I going to say? Yeah, there's a couple of types of aloe um, that you can craft. Um, this... So I use weak aloe because I can just craft it in my inventory. I just like to carry around aloe leaves and it's sufficient for my needs. Plus I have, um, uh, what is it called? Uh, faster healer, 50% increased healing from healing effects as well, which I've been using re recently. Um, these two, this one is just uh, aloe leaves and one alchemical base. So I think this is worth crafting, although you can pick it up from enemies in NPC camps and things like that. Um, this one is like expensive in comparison so i wouldn't craft that one i would consider crafting this one for dungeons and things if you need like a lot of healing um but bear in mind you will pick up replacements in the dungeons like we were in the wine cellar yesterday and we got loads of like loads of these um so you could just pick them up and not craft them and then you can also craft aloe extract in your alchemist bench which i never bother with so so yeah i just use weak aloe um but i personally think this one is maybe worth crafting and then just replace it when you pick it up there you go. There you go. <clears throat> Is the butt aloe extract good or not? Butt spots. Cancelled. Um, high level aloe potion, the more it heals you, no need to get the best aloe. Yeah. So the butt aloe extract is pretty sus, that's it. Run with weak and make it as I need it. Yeah, yeah. That's it. It's just kind of convenient, isn't it? Okay, so she is like, she's got a truncheon. Um, um. What level she's at? She's at level 10! Oh, look at her chasing him. What did you get, madam? Strong arms, three in strength. Nice. It's a good start. I kind of want her to level in strength and vitality. Um, I want her to kind of have a decent amount of health. If she loses any strength in a perk, I shall be salty, but these days we can reroll, so. Okay. Dun, da, 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 da. Do, 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 do. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. We haven't seen a Lagadari yet. I would quite like to see one of those. That is um, the daughter of Emir, who, uh, from whom you can get the, what is it called? Um, Frost Giant Bodyguard. Ooh, Anastera. We already have an Anastera, though. There's Yanos. So many people. Okay. So this is where, oh god, Anna Sorcerer. Let's just back out a little bit. We get Delincia. Always go back rather than forwards. She's trapped. Let me get her to teleport to me. Just she'd probably be okay. We could go in and fight her. But the best thing to do is just to run. So she teleports. She's on a leash. Dun, 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 dun. So yeah, health bar. 
Um, made this camp too easy now. Do you think so? No longer get the horn from her, you get it from the ice cave boss. You can't get it from Lagodara as well. She doesn't come with, from her anymore. Like the new, the new Azagarth have loads of name workers from here. Yeah, got it from her last night. So you can still get it. It's just both. Yeah, bonus. Now I fancy it. Now I fancy a donut. I know, right? I know. Do you have that effect on people? People are like, do you know what? I don't know why. I just feel like I could eat a donut. Um, let's give her some more heels. Have that effect on people? Yeah, I bet you do. I mean, having people think about donuts is never a bad thing, is it? There are worse, worse things to make people think about. All right, she's healed up. Yeah, I have. I had seen that um, pet on that dude as well. Da -da -dum, da -da -dum. But it's good to hear that Lagodara is still dropping it. So thank you for clarifying. I'm gonna kill Yanos. Ya These guys can get a lot of health, the Nordheimers, and they hit hard. They are excellent thralls. Like Janos, Leon, they're the same person, really. Um, well, let's get this person. Seeing as we, he's right here, he's unconscious, and we don't have a sorcerer yet, we may as well take him. Seeing as we have like a wheel and stuff. Um, sugar outer with us. What's your favourite kind of donut, people? <laughs> I think mine is like either it would either be like a custard donut or it would be like the traditional like jam donut with like sugar sugar on the outside yep probably not really had many donuts in my life though and I feel I yes I do feel afterwards I'm like oh god should I have eaten that do you know what I mean yeah I'm more of like a chocolate person or something probably a honey cruller or Boston Boston cream I might need pictures of those, Neff, in the Discord. I don't know. Da -da -dum. Can you still hear the game and stuff? Dum -da -dum -dum. Chocolate donut. How to get the camera? Are you on? Um, are you on console? Uh, One G. Who is that over there? Um, it's just the FOV in the settings. That's all it is. Not a mod, FOV, but it's not on console. Uh, it's just on, just on PC, unfortunately. Apple fritter. Ooh, nice. Do do. So there was, there's the armorer. Um, going to kill these people so they respawn as better versions of themselves. Go. Hearty feast, right? Yeah. Follower damage. And that concentrated extract. She won't eat hearty feast, I don't think. No, she'll eat lasting feast. I'll leave the fighters unconscious. You can do that. You can just leave anybody who you don't need to respawn um, unconscious and then just come back and murderify the respawns of... Uh, What's it called? Crafters. Da -dum, da -da -da. Da -dum, da -da. Greetings, friendo. I got a hammer too. I don't like your pokey friend. Do 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 do. Alchemist. Alchemist. I just love the Bector Corbin. It's so freaking good. So good. Hello, Wolf Bite. Hello, Biscuit Gravy. Hello. Pineapple. Pineapple glazed donut. Kitty. Hi, Kitty. Pineapple glazed donut. So is it pineapple inside, or the glaze is pineapple? I feel like they need to fix the weapons on these um, people, don't you think? Like when you see people using the 
They should have a hammer in their hands. This is a spawn point of the armor as well. We haven't, we haven't been lucky today. Da -dun -dun. Da -dun -dun. Do do do. We should make sure we collect the hearts from all those. Let me just grab them actually. We need to go collect the hearts from all the named people we modified because uh, we can trade those in at Hanuman's Grotto. Anastera. We already have an Anastera the Cirrus. And it's the topless variety. Which definitely isn't like more valuable. You know what I'm saying? Obviously. <clears throat> there's there's Yanis's heart. There we go. Perfect. Dum da dum. Alright. Greetings, friendos. Bum, bum, bum. What have we got? We can get those chieftains here, can't we? This is the heroic treasure spawned in the chieftain's hut, I guess, right now. If we wanted to walk that out, teleport it home, we would need a map. We could walk it all the way home to the pyramid. <laughs> Done that before. <coughs> Excuse me. Or oh, is a cough, not a sneeze, by the way. Do do do. Oh, I really want. She's here. She's here. She's here. Lagadara. Frick yeah. Oh, I love that. I manifested that chat. Okay. Oh, daughter of Amir. Is the is the mod called Greater Camera Distance? Wandre. I'm not using a mod. I'm not using a mod. I'm using an FOV slide, the FOV slider. I'm at 97 here. If you're on console, you won't have it. Otherwise, just go to video, vertical FOV, and change this number. Increase it. That's it. Um, tag team with donut picks. Thank you, Nefanor. Become a better you, and I'll help you guide by Anna R. Oh. Um, don't want to taste food that... I really want to taste that food, but can Oh, bless you. I always forget about that, Kevin. I want them to die for donuts. It was a donut I had as a kid. I think it was just pineapple flavour of the glazing. I guess that could be nice. As long as it's not on pizza, do you know what I'm saying, Grino? This is Lagadara, daughter of Amir. She's a mini boss. This is very exciting. Look at her. Hi, lady. You can't thrall her unless you you could spawn her in. Uh, ooh, ooh, lag is not ideal right now. Delincia fortunately has her mo uh, momentum. Look at her, she's just, she mowed all those people down. She's a beast, I love Delincia. What a god. Yep, there it is. The frost giant bodyguard. Pets. So you don't have to put this in a taming pen or anything. You just basically, I'm not going to do it here, but you just place it and this is your friend. So cool. Um, is the best rules, is the best rules are in New Azagoth. Um, there are some great, the fighters in New Azagoth, the northern Nordheimer fighters are very good. Like uh, Leon, Janos that you get up here are very, very good. They get lots of health. They hit very hard. Um, the Berserkers from um, Mounds of the Dead are very good. Delincia Snowhunter is very good. They don't get as much HP, but their damage modifier is slightly higher. I do have a video on my YouTube channel you can watch. Just the information about the cannibals, just ignore that because they've been nerfed for next chapter. That's it. Got that from Hrugnit. Yeah, that's it. Convince me to get my own Delincia. Yeah, Delincia is wonderful. Yep. She gets slightly more health than um, a Berserker. Um, my personal favourite, though, is a bearer, a named bearer, because they have they have like a bunch of carry slots. Um, they get like over 10,000. They can get over 10,000 health or tier 3 bearers. 
um, and I have like a video that's included in my fighter video as well which is just on my channel page on YouTube um, but I like them because they have loads of health you don't have to worry about dying and I like to do the damage myself so it depends what your playstyle is you know um, if you're gonna do dungeons and things and you're new to the game it can just be a good idea to get a thrall that isn't gonna die you know because it's kind of stressful and uh, you know whatnot you have to go back and retrieve your stuff and you know you lose all your things um so yeah tier three bearers or until until you can get like a named bearer are oh, brilliant put them in like strength buffing gear um give them stakes to level their vitality um and then give them like potions and food that buff their strength and you can every single like stream that i've done in this series that's on youtube now um shows you how i've how i've like geared up my thralls as well Got Ulrich, uh, Greater Yamato, Sabertooth currently to Nancy Sunset Amazing Edition. Yeah, definitely. Absolutely. Dum da da dum da dum da dum. Well, getting Lagadara is is definitely like I would consider that a win. She's she doesn't spawn very frequently. Can take a while. Bum, 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 bum. Lived in Hawaii for years. Never met one Hawaiian who liked fun of yeah, yeah. As a half Italian, it's not my first choice. I'm not like offended by pineapple on pizza. You know, Hawaiian pizza is like perfectly good. It's pizza. Um, the only game I played the pets were for tanking. That's it. Yeah, that's how I like to play. I want my pet to just. I just want my fighter to like tank and i want to do the damage generally speaking um what's the max tier of worker is named yep tier four named um right people thank you everybody so much for today i'm gonna end the stream here um i can't thank you enough everybody who contributed towards the graphics card i'm like absolutely blown away it's huge, huge support. So yeah, round of applause to everybody here who contributed. And uh, and everybody who's just hanging out. I appreciate that too. Thank you for the follows, the bits, the subs, gifted subs as well. Um, thank you for everything. I will be back tomorrow. Uh, we might do some more Conan. We might do something else. We'll see. Um, yeah, I will keep you posted on the uh, graphics card um, ordering. Because they will Throne will order that and send it. I'll keep you posted on that. I'll be... Um, Thank you to, was it Grayel who, who tipped me 40, 40 pounds, 40 dollars? Thank you for that as well. Hello RPG, hello lovely. Um, thank you everybody so much. Thank you to the anonymous people who like contributed as well. Um, huge thanks to Kevin who like freaking broke the bank to buy me that card. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you everybody. Thank you for, oh bless you. You're all absolutely lovely. Join the Discord if you haven't, people. Follow me on follow me on Twitch. Oh, we're in an ad break. Wonderful. Uh, follow me on Twitch if you haven't. Subscribe on YouTube if you haven't. All the things. Twitter. You know. You know the deal. Appreciate you all. See you soon. <laughs>